All right, let's get started. So today's 520, so we need to go to the therapist guy. I can remember how to get to this guy without doing the I am. So I'm just gonna get through the phone because I forget where he's at. Doesn't matter, doesn't matter. We will see him today on 520. I had nurse's office, that's right. I've been getting a lot of students coming in ever since I arrived here. To be honest, it's kind of a relief. That whole mess with Kamashita was the reason I was called here, after all. They warned me a lot of students had been impacted. I knew there would be a lot of free-floating anxiety. When I actually got to talk to everybody, I was pleasantly surprised. Most of the things on everyone's minds were college interest exams and relationship problems. In other words, typical worries for high school students. Some did open up about deeper issues, but not the majority. Some students were still struggling with the scars from the incident, yes. But at the very least, I'm glad to see the ones who came to me haven't taken... have taken some steps towards recovery. So they have, huh? Oh, well, that's not to say I've gotten a sense of every single student's emotional state. Either way, I hope my worries end up being groundless after all. I know I'm not the most reliable guy, but I. Re but remember, you can always talk to me too if something's bothering you. I am the counselor here, you know. If nothing else, I'm good at listening. Let's see. Having said that, it's a little awkward that I have to ask you for your help, but. Remember how I asked you to help with my research? Uh, of course. Sure. Several days ago. Totally already forgot about that. I said you'd be helping with my research, but don't worry. It won't be anything too difficult or intensive. I just need you to listen to what I have to say and work through some questions with me. So... Here, look at this image. What do you see? But let's see. Hmm. Maybe I should start at the beginning. I can tell you a little about what the research is for. What I'm studying now is the pain felt in the mind, or perhaps more fancifully, in the heart. Some specific examples include the pain of someone saying hurtful things to you or being separated from those you love. Maybe this would be clear, clearer pain defined by abstracts like trauma or stress. Bodily physical pain can be th thought of as something necessary and autonomic response to injury, illness, whatever. Still. But what about the pains felt within one's heart? That pain isn't born from any tangible problem in our bodies, right? It's something strange and immaterial. I guess it goes to show there are still a lot of mysteries in our own hearts and minds. You know, I... And I, well, I want to learn more about these internal psychological pains. Now, this is my question for you. When do you truly feel pain in your heart? Hmm. <laughs> when I get... I feel the pain, the true anguish when I get punched in the face. God damn. I see, yes, I can sympathize there. Sometimes all it takes is one betrayal for intense trust to turn into intense pain. It can be rough. It doesn't feel good to struggle with the pain inside of your heart. For example. But with that in mind, how about the pain of a broken heart then? 
After all, that kind of pain is only born because we fall in love, right? Do you have any thoughts on this kind of pain? Hmm. It is a seed for new love. I never took you for a poet, but it's a wonderful sentiment, a very positive way of looking at it. Internal emotional pain can be difficult to deal with, though some say it's always coupled with other feelings. I agree, of course. I think it's a fair assessment. Though, personally speaking, I'd be... I'd think if pain can be avoided, it should be. Maybe it shouldn't exist after all. Hmm. Wounds of the heart are much harder to detect, and in a way, they're far more complex than physical injuries. That's why I'm doing this research. To save people who are suffering from internal pain they keep holding on to. You helped me realize that purpose again, thank you. Did that help? Right. Of course, thanks to you I can articulate my thoughts for once. What do we get for rank 3? Chance to receive the effects of charge and concentrate at the so What? What? That's so good. Alright. kind of busted okay I think that'll do for today oh hmm why do I feel like I'm forgetting something <sighs> oh your mental training <laughs> crosses arms and legs Jesus oh uh, no I didn't forget about your promise our promise of course I'll teach you tricks for mental discipline and you help me with my research just like we decided right now then how about something like this today? All right. Oh, and here, never a bad time for a snack, right? Nice. Well, see you. Okay, now we're ready to wrap things up. Well, this is Maruki. Do you have time to talk right now? I'm taking a breather, just finished my last counseling session for the day. And I thought I'd thank you once again for your help earlier. Oh, good work over there. Thanks. A lot of students came by to talk today. Hopefully they got something out of it. But to be honest, it's pretty tough juggling this job and my research at the same time. Thanks again for agreeing to help me out. I might be looking for you to help more frequently from now on. It'd mean a lot if you could lend a hand. Alright, see you later. Ah, you're back. Yeah, maybe she said he's going to go drinking at the Manja restaurant. He'll go with me and help investigate undercover, right? Okay, we're gonna go with our boy. Oh, we unlocked a new area. Nice. Okay, a waterfront district surrounded by canals, famous for its manjiaki. Right. Of the good old days, eh? Uh, the teachers, the teacher who's with him has shit on me too. Sorry, but I'm gonna say hold up in the bathroom. Please, just leave your phone on so I can hear what they're saying. Wow, you can really hold your liquor, Yamamuchi. Mm, I've had some experience. Back in my college days, we'd rent a yacht for the weekend and have massive parties. I must say, though, sake's been tasting particularly sweet lately. No surprise there, things have been much calmer without Kamoshida. Those were some real dark times for Shujin, though, huh? But now that he's gone, you can finally get the chance you deserve. Ah, don't flatter me. He had his strength, sure, but because of him, our volleyball team will be forever scarred. 
The only real option now is to abandon it completely. There has to be a way to bring Shujin back into the limelight, though. That's where I come in. Oh, you mean with the track team, right? The students who went through so much hardship under Kamashita rise again with a caring new advisor. It'll be the rebirth of a team that found themselves in the depths of despair. The public will love it. Despite my lack of track and field knowledge, I'll form a tight bond with the students. I'll be the protagonist of my very own tearjerker. What a piece of shit. And of course, all the praise for reviving them will go to me, their incredible loving advisor. I'll have to hire a great coach if I want to pull this off, though. Oh, so you're going to pretend to coach them while someone else does all the legwork. That's amazing. Such stunning achievements will look great when it's time to hand out bonuses. But I'm not going to stop there either. I'll publish books, give motivational speeches. What about all the troublemakers on the team? I've heard that Naokoka that Naokoka kid is especially bad. Oh, you mean the one who asked them to bring the pre kamoshita coach back? Don't worry, I've already taken care of him. I broke his leg! There's this other boy on the team, Takeshi. Doesn't really excel in much of anything. Well, I said I would make him the new captain if he could get rid of that troublemaker. Wow. I might have mentioned something about how Nakoka was working with Kamoshita too. Subtly, of course. And what ended up happening? Apparently, Takeshi clashed with him. The plan worked perfectly. That's fucking rude, bro. And the best part is, not only are his parents loaded, but his mother's the president of the PTA. I see, he'd make a great pawn. Perhaps, but nothing like him could... But the... I can't read, Jesus Christ. Perhaps, but a nothing like him could never captain a successful championship winning team. He may have to have an unfortunate accident at practice one day. But until then, he can show the others the value of obedience. Ah, oh, you're incredible! Damn it! An effing asshole! If we don't do something quick, Yamauchi's gonna get rid of Ta Takeshi too. God damn it! Let's talk to him. Let's make sure he doesn't have that unfortunate accident. Yeah, this ain't our problem, it's the ta track teams. So they're just gonna have to decide on their own. Hey. You know, track ain't a team sport. Eh, at least sprinting wasn't. You got teammates, sure. Uh, you're really just looking out for your out for your own time. That's why I never thought about asking people for help or trying to solve our problems together. And again. But I can't ignore the stuff they're going through now. I mean, even though we had our own goals and shit, you're still running together. They suffered with me, gritted their teeth with me. Honestly, I think it was only because of them I was able to run it all. <laughs> so I can't just go and turn my back on them now, right? I know that ain't the coolest thing to say, but that's how I feel. I think you're cool, Ryuji. Uh, yeah. Oh, for real? I wish they'd voice. E I wish every for real was just voiced in this game. It'd make it so much better. When encountering a weak shadow, you may destroy it immediately. Nice. All right. Get that insta kill. Wait. Anyways, I'm starving. Let's eat some manja while we're here. So far, all I've seen of this place is the goddamn toilet. <laughs> Uh, good work today, man, and thanks for sticking around so late. But god damn it, Yamauchi, that dick, just thinking about him pisses me off. At this rate, the track team's screwed. He's just gonna take advantage of them. But I also don't wanna make a huge scene. I can't let myself mess up their chance to start the team again. Besides, I doubt those guys are gonna listen to anything I say. You never know until you try, my guy. That's true, gotta have faith in him. Anyhow, at least we know the truth about him. We just gotta figure out our next move. That eh, bastard munching on Manja like he's got us all figured out. He won't get away with this. 
In any case, thanks again for your help. Hey! Hell yeah. Got a seat on the bus. We need to finish this book right here. Hmm? Even when facing death, her soul was free. Wow. Oh. oh, we finished this book. <laughs> Some points in something, I don't remember. Oh, charm, okay. We need to get the Gallant Rogue today. Oh, do you ever use the study corner in the library? I always end up goofing off at home and not many people know of it. But isn't the environment kind of a problem? Have you heard of the rumors about the transfer student? Oh, him? Yeah, he used to be all anyone ever talked about. But you remember Mr. Kamashita's big apology? The transfer student's kind of old news now. My recent test scores haven't been so hot. If I don't shape up, my allowance could be in danger. I'm in danger. Today we're going over. It's possible to apply math even to an abstract concept like beauty. The golden ratio used in the Mon Mona Lisa and the Parthen... The Parthenon is a famous example, but a different ratio has been used in Japanese art and architecture since ancient times. I'm sure you've all heard of the silver ratio. Now then, take a look at this. Give me an answer. Obviously not this. I think it's the middle answer. This is it. Precisely. Hell yeah. You can see it's closer to a square than the golden ratio, right? One theory says it's because Asians have rounder faces than Westerners, so they prefer a similar shape. This ratio was used in things like Ukiyo-e's paintings and the pagodas at that temple because I can't say words. They're too hard. One you should all be familiar with is B4 size paper. Those proportions are the silver ratio. Nice going. Oh yeah, I hear the mat the mass that mass gods that are seen as cute have faces that are closer to this ratio. In other words, if you use this ratio, you can make cute things. I see. Huh. Neat. Gotta get to the library, turn this book back in. Um. I'm so sorry for what I said. I judged the book by its cover. I failed as a librarian assistant. There may be times when other students give you a hard time, but please don't mind them. Feel free to use the library whenever you want. <laughs> well, I certainly don't sense that hostility I was feeling from everyone before. You can hone your knowledge here quite nicely now, but you won't be able to raise your guts anymore. What would you like? You gotta return this one. Thank you. What would you like? We gotta get the Gallant Rogue. Here. When does yeah. speed reader unlocks? Speed reader 6 1? Alright.
Alright, so I have Ryuji at 7. Sun's at 1, Death's at 3. Alright, so Ryuji's almost done. Wait, who else is, is anyone else anywhere near that? 3, 2, 3, 2, 7. 1, 3, 2, 1, 3. I can do strength whenever. Easier to do it the later we go into the game. I'm not fucking going anywhere with you. Wait, what day is it? It's Saturday? Let me check the vending machines. Courtyard. Before I do anything, I'm gonna check all the vending machines and grab these. Just so we have them, so we can do a little tiny bit of grinding, grinding if we need to. Shit. Oh. Check the left side, nothing here. Oh. Pretty sure these are the same. Actually. Oh. Yeah, they're all the same. They considered one NC, I guess. Um, let's go here. I think I might have emptied oh. this one out. No, not this time. Okay, cool. Toss all that. Mm. Alright, so we're gonna go here. We're gonna go to the hideout. And we're gonna get to the treasure today. We still need to explain the basics to you, don't we? Oh, you mean about the metaverse and the nav? <laughs> yeah, I guess that stuff is pretty important. Please elaborate. Okay, let's start from the beginning. First, the metaverse spots where we act as the phantom thieves are called palaces. Palaces are worlds that take form from someone's cognition. A materialization of their reality. So, do we each hold palaces within ourselves as well? No, not just anyone will have one. It's primarily those with strong, distorted desires. They basically gotta be criminals. Real bastards like Kamoshida or Matarame. On the other hand, palaces can't exist within Persona users. It's just impossible for them to form. Basically, your Persona is the true feelings of your heart, which arise from accepting your inner shadow. Then, since you have full control over your emotions, there's no way your desires can get distorted. S so that's how it works. Uh, obviously. I, I knew that. Oh yeah, and we use the Metaverse Nav app on our phones to get into that world. It's actually pretty simple. Just say a person's name, location, and distortion, then you're in. Location? Uh, so like, Matarame's would be Shaq. Then his distortion is that he thinks it's a museum. How do you know what their palace is going to look like if you've never set foot in it before? That part's kind of like a quiz or something. It'll probably get pretty tricky from here on out, too. Hmm. I feel as though I have a good grasp on the basic concepts. If anything arises which I fail to understand, I'll rely on those more experienced than myself. Yeah, I got you covered, newbie. Uh, you should probably ask Morgana if you need anything. Thinking back to Matarame, though, I can't believe he'd consider pressing charges. Yes, I've never seen him show such anger before. He is most likely quite serious about that. What should we do? There's no way we'll be able to win if that happens. He likely won't act on that threat until the final day of the exhibit, June 5th. Simply put, I doubt he would be so foolish as to taint his name with a trial during his exhibition. Alright, so we just gotta steal Matarame's heart by then? There's no way we're gonna let him press charges. We'll show people who he really is. Okay, let's go. Alright, so... Oh. 
Oh yeah. We need a fair amount of money. We haven't decided on the new recruit's code name yet. It has to be Kitsune. You know, with that Kitsune mask and everything. Are you talking about me? What do you I want your name over here to be? Gift Ryuji's dialogue. Hell yeah! That really leaves an impression. Are you talking about me? I'd say Da Vinci. Ha! <laughs> nope. Well, you've got that mask like On said, and there's that weird tail. All right, you're Aburage. <laughs> Very well. He's agreed to it? It's decided then. Aburage. Such a shit name. Nuh uh, not happening. Do you have any ideas, Joker? Let me see the options give me. I don't remember. Clown. Clown! <laughs> ah, shit. Oh, just keep it literal, huh? Sounds good to me. What do you think, Fox? It's acceptable. It's set then. Let's go. By the way, we should have Joker decide who our starting lineup is from here on out. Starting lineup? You mean the ones who'll be going in first? Yeah. Now that Fox has joined us, it'll be harder to move around as a group. Considering how we've operated to this point, we should have four starters. Anyone else can be backup. And I guess we always gotta have our leader with us, right? Exactly. That's why we'll have Joker choose the remaining three. And what should the backup do? Would it be best for them to stay outside of the palace? No. They should come in as well, but maintain a reasonable distance from the main group. In other words, the starting lineup is the first wave of our infiltration force. Well, we'll leave the team composition to you, Joker. Hell yeah. May I get a word in? Sorry to cause you trouble. Joker. Yeah. Hell yeah. Anything to get rid of Morgana. Hmm. Yes. All right. Let's grab any little small treasures we can grab today. So we're gonna run back through the palace. Gonna do a normal run through the area. Damn it. It's somewhere. Can grab this one. I forgot this was even a uh, treasure we could take. Alright, so. Oh, uh, that's not what I want to do. Let me out! Show me your true form! Dangerous one in there. I should have just did a regular attack. Fuck. Two enemies remaining. Don't let your guard down. Oof. Let's go. Not this. Oh, nice. Give me money. Nice. <laughs> Who's next? Yeah! Victory! Okay. Alright, so we need at least $120,000. We have right now. Oh, we already have the money. That makes things really easy. 
I'll reveal your true form. All right. Money while we're in here doing this. Ooh, hell yeah! Thank you. We all did great, huh? Yeah, victory! Okay, I can see it. I'll reveal your true form. What's a crit? Nice! You just keep giving me money, fuck it. I want to get a bit over what we need to have to buy items. Who's next? Yeah, victory! All right. <sighs> Show me your true form. <laughs> to fight those two. Uh, oh, oh, nope, there's nothing right there. We just have to run through, grab everything up. Anyway, I want to make sure I have more than enough money. It's somewhere. I'm 34 currently. Uh, we'll have to go through that hallway eventually anyway, so it doesn't matter. Keep missing everything. Thank you. Swap the Joker. Dollars. Thank you. <laughs> Losers. A spectacular victory. 
All right. So we get 4K in total. So that's nice. I'll reveal your true this form. This is a good experience, too. Let me get this boy. Um, God, I forgot what he's weak to. Strong for us to get right now. Center level for him. Okay, guys. Persona. How about this? Nice. I am thou. <laughs> oh, he blocks physical. Whatever. Serves you right. Oh my fucking god, I forgot how strong this guy is. Alright, I should have just killed him as soon as we started the fight. Let's go. Fox gun too? Fuck. Alright, just gotta knock him back down then. All right, so. All right. I have something. That was a cl Since he's not with us, they're done. It's somewhere. Got this one. Oh, yeah, there's a room beside here. I would, I completely forget about. Oh, if I run through that, I can it'll automatically do do shit for me. Okay. I feel a little silly now. Hmm. I'll reveal huh? your true form. Alright! Oh, no. Complete the fire, which I don't think we have. Nope. Hmm. Yo! Nice. Yeah, 
Yeah, he's a hermit. We don't want him. No need for you right now. Nice. Your power is incredible, Joker. Oh, I know the persona we need to pick up while we're in here. All right. I remember now. True form. We're waiting for one of these times where we get an instant kill. Let's go. No joke. Be careful. Oh, yo, we got the. Okay, only I get the bonus. Okay, that's a little more fair than I thought. Okay. We just use this. Pop it on you. Looking cool, Joker. Go ahead. Not over yet. Damn. Well, on to the next A trial. Spectacular victory. Ooh, sooty, sooty elders armor. We're gonna have to take. Okay. <laughs> that was easy. We're gonna have to take a day later and go through all of the dirty items we have because we have like 12, 15. A lot more than I thought I have by now because I've gotten a lot of a lot of a lot of times I was trying to get items from the shadows I got junk items instead of getting actual like stat items which I guess isn't bad because we're gonna get time to do that it's just focus I don't have time to do it right now. Wow, that shadow was crazy. Let's go. All right, same thing as last time. Bam. Ooh, looking cool, Joker. Do it. All right, Hacker. Pass the baton and follow up. Take that out. Oh, that's right. That's weak to gun. Skull, please stop missing easy attack. a lot of money. Oh, not this time. Oof. Oof. I am not very happy. <laughs> Losers. Yeah! Victory! I mugged that shadow for like eleven dollars. Right. <sighs> Missed this one last time. Show me your 
true form. I might get caught in the middle of the floor because of this. It's up to you. I got this. Level 17 for the persona that I want to get. Okay. That I want to fuse for. That enemy was Let's really see weak. Let's see. Oh yeah. Never got to go this way last time. Get rid of that. Show me your true form. Let's go. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Tough. Pretty good. Oh, not this. Looks like hitting its weak point is an option. Kanagi! Ravage that! Oh, really? Yeah. 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 Victory is right. ours. Mm, nice work. Fun team. is very, very squishy still. Dodge electric. Ooh, nice. Okay. I can see it. Uh, that was a close one. Pop this. Oh yeah, we haven't found any of the items. The little skulls. Joker! Oh. Give me the box. What's in the box? Black shell, skills, Morgana. It's nice having the fourth part, the uh, fourth teammate now, because we don't have to heal. Using our main party members to do damage. All right, nothing over here. Wait, what is in here? Oh, this is the above area for this. Ooh, gimme, gimme. Oh, it's gonna let us get over this wall. I was wondering how we get over. I can feel it. Last time. Do that. Oh, okay, there's a door here. One of Madarame's will seeds. Let's I'm guessing we're gonna cut scenes since Yusuke is new, but hopefully we won't. Nice. Red vanity seed. What is this? This sinister looking object. It's so important. It's, it's so compelling. I call them will seeds. Palaces will always have a few of them tucked away somewhere.
Alright, let's okay. see how much money we have now. Oh, we can get pretty close to 150. We, like, we'll get pretty close to almost 200 at this rate. Alright, so through this way, we're gonna save at this one right here. Alright. Alright. I'll just add this. Safety save. Come on. Just in case something claps the shit out of us. Yeah. Sweet secure the security's still down. Thanks to all my hard huh? work. What do you mean by that? Don't worry about it. Come on, let's keep going. Thank you in this courtyard. Wow. Wow. Why are these steps here? That is a tough shadow. I want to check around all of these blinds because if we don't, there could be something hiding behind them. Alright, nothing. Cool. Oh, look at this fucking dumbass. Uh. What does this do? There. Let's go. Prepare yourself. Tenacious. Persona! Let's go, Captain! We're on the ground! Let's take at least three of these and knock this guy out, right? Yeah, probably. Persona! Take this! Someone finish it! Let's do this! Persona! Oh, you want more? Alright. Kill him this time. Nice going, Skull. Finish him. It's time. Fuck, done, doesn't he? This is my other self. <laughs> Loser. Yeah, victory. Yeah, we've got to get a little bit stronger than those for the next um mini. Okay. Is, if there is a mini boss, I can't remember. That was a little too Next easy. mini boss might shit on us. Oh, I can get this now. That brochure. Oh, do you think that could be another pamphlet? Let's take it with us. All right, now we have the map. Hey, ain't this pamphlet different from the one we got before? You're right. It says it's the second out of two. That's the rest of the map. It looks like. Hmm. We need to pass through the lounge and the gallery in order to reach it. The deeper in we go, the tighter security's gonna be. We need to advance carefully, okay? But the safe room. Oh, that's a treasure chest. One free revival bead. There's like no lock light. chests in here for some reason. I have like eleven lock picks. A shadow joker. We can't go that way. Joker! Ugh. I feel like I might accident I might touch them accidentally. Let's be careful as we go through here. Um, There's a treasure chest! Fuck this area, I hate it. Show me your true form. <laughs> Let's go! The first move is ours! Persona! Take this! Persona! What? I need to feed it! What are these weeks here? Go, give me more! Ravage me! Oh. Ice, okay. All enemies defeated! Just what I'd expect from you, Joker! A spectacular victory! Okay. It's so 
That was so Let's easy. See, we have to, oh, there's two chests here, but we're gonna have to get rid of the blinds. Oh, I need to slide right here. Joker, there's a treasure. Give me that box. I have something. Yeah, I want to take the security off of that area. Oh, that's a mini boss right there for sure. Hey, there's a strong looking one over there. We've seen that kind before. His stance conveys the notion that he is no ordinary foe. I think the control room's behind him. He's probably guarding it to make sure nobody gets too close. However, we'll need to disarm the security if we want to ensure we have a safe infiltration route. Forcing our way through seems to be our only option. Oh, let's go beat this guy's ass. Hey. Hmm? Step aside. You expect me to move just because you tell me to? I'm afraid you're sorely mistaken. I'm gonna make you move, bud. Let's go. Come on, strike! Ah, oh, nice one, Fox. Persona, come on. Ah, oh, nice one, Fox. Let's swap to. I want to swap to on because I want to just get some good damage out. Yeah, that'll miss. He's already got an affliction. Oh, okay. That's fucking annoying. Come on. Go down. Ooh. Looking cool, Joker. Go ahead. Right. Fox taking Pass over. This is my other self. Die. All right, he's only gonna get to move one more time. Oh, he's not gonna get to move at all. All right, that was way too easy. I gotta use this next time. Whew, that guy was tough. I guess that's just par for the course in a palace. It really was on a totally different level from the other enemies, though. Hmm, he dropped some sort of card. Skill card is a special type of item used to teach one of your personas a particular skill. These cards can only be used with personas in your stock. For? I've never seen anything like it. Ain't it just some kind of loot? Come on, let's get back to exploring. There's a treasure chest. Oh! We have nine lockpicks, so let's just go ahead and open all these. Oh, that's a sword for Fox. Oh. Oh, we got our hands on quite the weapon. I'd love to get a feel for it. Okay. Hmm, this hits me perfectly. What an excellent find. Indeed. It appears this is the control room for the security. Sweet! Let's turn that shit off already. I think we need two cards. Please input the password. Uh, uh, another one? We'll just have to look for someone else who might know it. Shit. I hear the intruders already got past the central garden security. Yeah, I just got a car there to change the password here too. What too? Better not be simple. Well, I was having some trouble coming up with a good one. For now, I set the set it to the numbers for Lord Matarame's feet. Lord Matarame's feet? What are you talking about? Let's get back on duty. There's a chance the intruders are nearby. Hmm. Matarame's feet. The hell is that supposed to mean? Maybe a shoe size? Yo, Fox! You know that bastard shoe size? No. Unfortunately, I've never heard him mention it. Are you sure that's the proper password? Matarame's feet. What do you think that can mean? Show me your true form. Now's our chance to strike. I shall put you to the sword. Yeah, 
I don't have fire on him. Fuck. Hold on. Yep, so I need to move twice because of that. Jack Frost is a magician. Give me money. Eh. Probably better than any item he's gonna give me at this point in the game. Okay. Alright. I have something. So we got two go points. Oh fuck. I'll reveal oh. your true form. And with this one. There's a dangerous Ew, one fuck. in there. Let's go. Go Ah, nice one, Fox. I am thou. Go on, strike. Ah, nice one, Fox. Swap to Joker. Okay. Not over yet. Next up. But we better find a weakness. Go down. The other one's gonna explode for a lot of damage. Oh, nice. Yeah, nice. Got a sleep okay. file. It worked out last time we used one of those. Stylish victory. Show me your true form. This is supposed to be another tough set of enemies. Alright, so... Persona. Persona. Let's see that again. We need that one. Persona. I don't want to hit both. This should kill this one? Not move a muscle. How about we trade? Let me your power. It looks scared. Use soothing words. Me lost, so me pay quants consequences. Me am ready in soup. <laughs> me am really in soup now. Do what you want. Me am ready if you want grill me, so. And I don't want to eat you. Me pretty sure you know what me mean by grill. But you play along and make joke, you nice person. Young human, me see you make effort to talk to me. There's something you won't say to me, right? Let me touch your paw. Oh fuck. You understand you a bit better. Fuck! Let's pull back for now. That's the first one I fucked up. Okay. So I can't go this way. Hmm. Where do I need to go from here? I remember getting lost the first time I played this. Oh, I see. <laughs> There's a vent somewhere I can get to. Hmm. Where are we at, though? Oh, I missed that, so I can feel it. Hmm. I can't have to go further back. That makes no sense. 
not around me's feet. Maybe he has a foot fetish. Maybe it's the password to his OnlyFans account. Where he exclusively sells feet photographs. We must have to go back this way. Look around. I don't see shit. I have something. Um, hmm. I don't. I don't know. It's gotta be in, like, this area. Good, that reset the enemies. That's what I needed to. This is my other self! Ran away. Loser. All right. Nice work, team. Maybe I shouldn't have feared him. Okay. I have something. Uh, okay, yeah, I can examine this. There's something written here. Here we praise our most holy Lord, Madarame, the one ray of hope in this depraved world. He stands alone, as his two adept hands paint the future. None shall ever match his excellence. <laughs> yeah, he's really puffing his chest out here, ain't he? Hold on a moment, could this be the spot of Madarame's feet that the security guards mentioned? It's at his feet, alright. But isn't the password supposed to be a number of some kind? Hmm, I do believe there are numbers here though. One ray of hope stands alone with the two adept hands, none shall match him. 1020. What, right? Oh, 1120. Nice! I don't know why I thought 1-0. Sweet, let's head back and shut down the security. For some reason I like thought alone meant zero, because I'm dumb as fuck. Uh, I think this Show me your true the form. person I need. Let's pop that mask. Alright, perfect. Let's go. Oh, nice one, Fox. Ah, oh, it's gonna hit all of them. Shit. So this isn't too, too, too much damage to him. Oh, probably did. Fuck. Alright, he barely lives. Perfect. Plenty of your power. It looks scared. Shooting so words. Why you keep trampling here? What are you humans thinking? You soothing words. I'm sorry. Pure human. I don't know what to say. Okay, yeah. Just have to say that. Cool. Alright, what arcana are you? You are hanged, man. Uh, let's give her to slime for now. We don't need two chariots. Your power's incredible, Joker. But at least we have that one. 
Can we hang Ben later? And since we've already, we'll have this one uh, okay. purchasable. Even if we get rid of him, we'll I have can him. Feel it. All right, so let's get back to the area and put in that password. Show me your true form. That might pay out. You're so gorgeous, Panther. Sixty-one thousand. Okay. Pretty good amount of money. The decision is yours, Joker. Show me your true form. These guys have no peripheral vision at all. Yeah, that was a waste. Gorgeous All according to plan. 160 XP. All right. I can see it. Huh? That was a little too easy. I'll reveal oh. your true form. Let me get him to give me money, see if I can get a good amount. Give me some money. And ask for this. 2,000 yen, okay. All according to plan. Mm, nice work, team. The closer we get to 200,000, the more confident I'll be in all the stuff that we're gonna okay. start having to buy. Uh, 164. Oh, yeah. Get to 180-ish and pick up enough treasure we might get to it. That door to just stay open so that you waste time doing that animation. Yes! Alright, let's get those boxes. Oh, that opened up all sorts of stuff. We'll definitely be able to get to more places now. Come on, let's get moving. Let's go get those boxes. Not this way. I gotta go all the way back around to get to those chests. Uh, didn't open that door though. Oh! We still have eight lock picks. Use one of them. And let's get in this one. See what's in here. Fucking clicked it too fast, doesn't matter, it was a recovery item anyway. Focus. For HP and not for. Oh, you can't get through that one. I'm blind. Alright. Right back the way we came. We're gonna go through that painting. This is amazing! What a giant painting! Indeed, it bears such a bizarre texture as well. It's as though I could simply slip inside. What the? What happened? Uh, um... My hand, it actually entered the painting. So, we can go inside of it? Well, I don't see any other path for us to take. Let's give it a try. I won't forgive you. How dare you trample onto my tranquil bamboo garden with those grimy feet. You shall not leave alive. Ah, what the heck was that? 
are probably just hearing Matarame's thoughts. There's no need to panic. <clears throat> Matarame. Oh. oh, we're in another painting. Hmm. So this space is not merely one, but a multitude of paintings. Hmm. You're really telling me they're all connected? Uh, which one goes where? And we will have to continue walking to find Joker. out. Joker! Yeah, there we go. How foolish. So he dares to call us thieves who dirty his heart. The one who has sullied the very nature of art itself has no right to accuse us of such things. Save your emotions for later. We have to keep moving. This way. Grab this. Check money. 164. Hey. Hey, don't get staring at my butt. Should have known. Over here, okay. Hmm? Oh, this feel Show me oh. your true form. Huh? The first move is ours. This is my other self. Go on. Oh, nice one, Fox. Not over yet! Come on! Did you see that again, Panzer? Not this one. Oh, fuck. No, I missed one. Alright, I need to do that again to knock them down. Good experience with that. One of the damage think? move. Okay. All right. I can feel it. Shadow defeated. Get this. Open this door, which is just a shortcut. Then we're gonna go to that door that we that takes us to another area. Treasure hall. Cool. Come. I don't think we have too much further to go. That. Come on. Huh, more big paintings, just like the ones we saw before. There's something off about these, though. Look, there are even two frames with no paintings at all. Now, yeah, why don't we go take a closer look? Focus. Let's not be able to go this way. Yep. This door doesn't. Can look I like go it this opens. way? This is our only option. Let's go this way. Nothing in here. Alright, well, I'm just gonna hop into. Hey, it's just like the last time, you know, with the secret passage inside and everything? Hmm. Looks like these ones are completely different. What to do? There are even frames with no paintings at all. That is strange, but we don't have a choice. Let's go. Yeah, there's another. Well, I can jump down here. But all that takes us to is this little treasure. Oh, treasure! Give me, give me, give me! Hey, that's a rare one. Persona. Let's do this. Eat this. Such a pain. Persona. You're on the ground. Don't move. Nice going, Skull. Ah, to think you would coerce me into giving in, but I am already within you. Any further exchange is meaningless. I already exist within your heart. There cannot be two of the same being in one soul. I would have liked to have gotten to... It's time. I think if I knock him out, I get decent experience, though. Mm. Oh, yes. great, huh? 300 EXP and 6,000 yen? Hell yeah. All right. So that gets us to 170, right? 171, 455. Perfect. 
So we just need to get another 90k while we're here this time. We'll have 200,000. Probably. Can I? Oh, there we go. Alas! This world is a desert filled with laymen who cannot understand the true beauty. The so slow drain of my skill is inevitable when I am surrounded by such a mediocrity. So he's gonna blame the world for his decline in skill? Huh. That bastard never had any real talent to begin with. Ah, the gods, even in their dormancy, are worshipped constantly. People gather under shrine gates, offer their money, and return home fully satisfied. Art is practically the same. In the end, it's all just a matter of imagination. Huh. Even if that's true, that doesn't give you the right to be deceiving people. It's somewhere. Uh... Alright, we're back where we started. Hard work is not what makes a sapling grow thick with green leaves. Too many young people do not see the true value in youth these days. What fools. Is it truly wrong for an expert such as myself to capitalize on that youth before it wastes away? Oh, what the heck? He's basically saying he's jealous of young talent. Look at me, I've turned into a cat, but I'm still fighting. Age isn't a valid excuse. Going whoa, whoa, where is this? Hop to this. This does something. Oh, it unlocks the other paintings. Okay. Whoa! Wow, look, another painting. So passing through one hidden route leads to the formation of another. What an elaborate ruse. It's highly likely there is a new path through the paintings. We should investigate. Boing. And we climb here. Hop up here. It's somewhere. We're back at the beginning now, so that doesn't do anything. This might go somewhere now. Yep, there we go. Uh, could a ship skirt across the ocean if its crew had to constantly worry about what sea life may lie below? Art, life, water, they are all identical. One who ascends to the summit is the victor. Yeah, so he's using all those pretty words, but he's basically saying people are like stepping stones. That's just like what he did to all those kids. Trust him for his art. What a piece of shit. How suspicious. Yeah, is that an octopus? It's pretty damn big. Do you think it's safe for us to approach it? I mean, let's just say it'll yeah. be fine. Oh, I did not know that happened. That's cool. Hmm. That was a valiant effort. For real? Shadows. I'll reveal your true form. That never happened before. That's neat. Persona! There! Persona! You gotta aim! Get ready! Take this! Persona! Captain Kid! You're on the ground! Nice right. going, Skull! Okay, guys. Ugh. Ooh, nice. Let's go. Hey, out. Oh, never mind. I lied. This is my other this self. Will, though. We're done here. Let's go. A spectacular victory. Thirteen hundred. Pretty good. Pretty good. Okay. They were nothing. Focus. All right, back through the paintings. Go this way. Go straight across again. Check the boat. Uh, just jump out right here. Hit this, and then I'll unlock the other painting. Oh, another painting. Oh, there are no longer any empty frames at this point. I bet there's a new path again, too. Let's get in there and check it out. <laughs> no, we can't get him back in from here. Okay. Oh, we have to start from the beginning again? No new path here. Um, is there a new path in this one? Oh, 
Oh, doing that since it's back to the beginning anyway. Alright, so we have to go probably up that hill again. Yep, there we go. Beauty is merely a mirage. Transforming that into money is what brings about true happiness. My fine mansion, my lifestyle among the chosen few. Those things are true art. So running your Altier out of a shabby rundown shack was simply an act after all. How foolish I was to have been deceived for so long. Get out of here. Yeah. yeah, sweet, this has got to be the end. How despicable. We have encountered so many of his paintings, yet not once did he mention a love for art. These are no paintings. They are just meaningless self-assertions placed in picture frames. I'm excited to see how this change of heart alters him. Maybe he'll actually start painting. In prison. I can feel it. Show me your true form. I hear. I will see. Where it at? Persona. Kushi Mitama. Ravage them. Looking cool, Joker. Go. Not over yet. Yeah, that again, it's completely out of fucking SK. I don't think we'll need it though. Your true form. This is my other self. Surprisingly tough. Persona. Persona. Actually, hit the technical. Oh yeah, you can. No sudden move. You're the best enhancer. This will end you. Persona. Go down! Persona! We all attack because of that. Wait, what? Worth 220 experience. We have to kill those every okay. time we see him. Shadow nice. defeated. That was easy, huh? Look, a see, treasure I chest. I hear a will see. Why don't we crack it open? I fucking hear it. Where's that? It has to be above us somewhere, or but well. Find the treasure and don't find the will see. So, um... Show me your true form. To run around a bit. Go. Go down. Looking cool, Joker. Think she can do one attack. You do. But that's it. No sudden movement. Need some money, actually. And ask for this. Oh, that was disgusting. Whatever. Let's 
fall back for now. That was some bullshit. thousand more yen to get to where I want to go to, though. I hear a chest somewhere. Wow! That shadow was crazy! Oh, no! Skull's been knocked flat! Ah, shit. The knockdown party member has been taken as a hostage. Whether or not you can rescue them depends on your negotiation abilities. Choose your words wisely. I don't have any of them. Hell yeah. Wait, what's the meaning of this? Are you, there are more of you? Oh, that's gonna be a crit. Yes! Anything her. Wow. Wow, Ryuji. You fucking suck, bro. No. In danger. Of course. Um, I'm actually gonna see if I can get her yes. on the team. I am the the what persona or like what arcana? Oh, you're lovers? See you later, Pixie. That's a new one, isn't it? Everyone's dead, because I'm a dumbass. Okay. I have something. Alright. What do I have? Water of Rebirth. Okay, eight of these. Let's give 30 back to on. Just as a precaution, there's something this way. Let's grab this treasure. This is probably the next soul thing. Huh? Wait, what did I do wrong? No, I would only jump down here. Oh! Hey! Oh, right here. Why not try our grappling hook? It looks like. We've gotta get past these shutters. That's one of Mater that is one of Matarami's will seeds. How do we get rid of these shutters? Here first. So this is where we came in through. Yeah, this is 100 percent the way we came in through. So there's nothing over here. Nothing. Nothing. We just have to keep going forward. Wait. I can see it. Is there nowhere else to go this way? Behind that wall. No, I'm not seeing anything. It's somewhere. Yeah, 
gap down here. I'm just dumb. I gotta continue on this way. Oh, what's this? Where's this take us? Before we do anything else. Right there, hop up. I can oh, feel it. A treasure chest. Oh, of course. Just a Just a button to hit. Alright, we'll see two in a box. Is it locked? Nope. Uh, one, one item. One not so great item. Not this way. Alright, this should be we'll see two. Please don't be we'll see three, because if this isn't, I don't know where to go. This. The second wheel seat. It has such a mesmerizing shape. All right, let's continue through here. Oh, yeah, that's right. I completely forgot about this area. Damn it! Ah, shit! What the hell is up with this place? There's so much gold. It's hurting my eyes. For real? Yeah, the distortion is especially bad here. It's barely holding up. Plus, it's not even our, on our map. So, we must ascertain the truth through our eyes alone. I have something. Alright, we only have one path right now. Go through here, hop down here. Grab this. Why do I keep circling around it? Holy shit. I can I, um, it. hop up. I will wait till he turns around. I'll reveal your true form. The first move is ours. Persona, go in, Oh, nice one, Fox. Time passed to Joker. Persona. Go down. Damn. Ooh, wow. We all did great. Like one shot. Hot nice damn. Nice work, team. The persona. This is strike. Power. All right. I could have handled that myself. Yep. I we can get feel plenty it. of money by the time we're done. I only have one path to take this time. How could this be? I thought I'd seen everything there was to see of this distorted world, but to think it would conjure up such a bizarre place. So, like, which way are we supposed to go? I didn't see any of the I didn't see any other ways forward, did you? Huh? Uh, what's this? Ah! Oh, well, part of the wall was peeling, so I just pulled it off. That wasn't an actual wall. I see, so it was camouflaged. We may have been trapped here for eternity had you not noticed that. Nice going! Uh, sure. You know, I just got lucky, right? Listen up! There might be more walls like this up ahead. Let's keep an eye out. Alright. Whoa! Oh, did we just warp? It seems even the paths beyond these apertures are distorted in the same way as this room. this painting here? It's probably some kind of illusion. We're in a palace, after all. Well, I guess the painting itself might be correct, though. But, but... You say correct, but aren't they all counterfeit? Although, maybe the real one's here, too. I wonder. Either way, the fact that this is here might mean it's connected to this space in some way. I have something. Oh, I'm gonna jump here first. Let's examine these. This painting, is it the Sayuri? I mean, hey. yes. Isn't that a fake? I mean, this is Matarame's palace. There is an obvious difference if you look closely. It shouldn't be too difficult to tell them apart. Hey, yeah, maybe it's obvious for you, but what do you think, Joker? No. What? A fake could never have such a luring charm to it, huh? So you're telling me it's real? I had no idea. Well, it is only an illusion, but this painting is without a doubt a spinning image of the true Sayuri. <clears throat> Ah, oh, they found us. Four enemies. 
Persona! Don't worry, Go ahead, Mom. There's still nothing special. It's up to you. Sure. Not over yet. Persona! You're mine. Three enemies defeated. Serves Good you one, right. Joker. Uh, let's see what he is. It seems jolly. Try cracking the joke. Try cracking the joke. Ugh. <laughs> Snow off your fingers, show me it's true. Um. Here we go. Thank you. What are you? What arcana? Oh, temperance. I actually need one of those. Drop the hangman persona. Incredible, now I don't have to fuse a temperance persona. I'll have it for later. Alright. This makes that really easy. I can feel it. What's up here first though? Oh, there's a path here. Yeah, I doubt that's the right one. Can't miss this. Oh, never mind. That puts us at the beginning. This... Seems it's just a trick after all. He would not let us proceed that easily. Oh, that means we go this way. I have something. Is this? Wait, do I have to re-examine this? Hey. <laughs> it's beautiful. Vibrant crimson clothes, her beautiful hair, the sublime balance between the subject and the background. This may only be an illusion, but it is without a doubt the spitting image of the true Sayori. Oh, okay, we have to do that. Yes! Seeing, the, seeing past the false image has opened a path to the truth. Mm, this golden place filled with counterfeit work is a prime example of the alchemy of Madarame's brain. And here, just as in reality, he entraps those who cannot see through his lying facade. Yeah, you might be right. No wonder the distortion is so strong here. Hey. hey, so what does that mean? I think it means finding the real Sayori should break through the distortion to open a path. So we just gotta check all of them? Why do we do that? Let's just look for the real one, assuming we can differentiate. I mean, it's pretty easy. These are both fake. Hey. <laughs> that is correct. Nicely said, Joker. Hey. Yeah. This one's also fake. <laughs> the real one's over here. Hey. This is the real thing. Wow. Yes, this is the true Sayori. It may be an illusion, but there can be no mistaking its allure. Treasure. Run down. All right, we're gonna go down here first. It's a lot of pet. Oh, it's just path to fake paintings. Well, fuck me. What's the other way then? Oh, it's just another path to another fucking shit painting. Hey. This one's real. Impossible. Wait. Okay, I wasn't paying attention to one of the details. Let's go. Oh, he blocks guns? 
Arizona. Koba Tengu! Go down! We're all knocked down! No that was incredible! Don't oh, give me money. Nope, oh, didn't ask for this. Eh, whatever. Victory is ours. Hmm, nice work, team. All right. It's somewhere. Hmm, this is. Wait. How is... How are these different? How is this one and this one different? Am I blind? Or am I dumb? Whatever, man. Hey. Oh, no. God. Why did I say that? I'm fucking dumb, bro. Oh, and I got... Oh no. We're got numbers. Wait for your chance. Now. Ah. on, strike. Oh, nice one, Bob. This is my other self. Go on. Oh, nice one, Bob. Two enemies remaining. Persona. Don't let your guard down. Kushimitama. You're mine. Fucking cool, Joker. All right. Nice. Ooh. Mm, All right, nice doesn't work, matter. Team. That was spicy. With this power. Okay. Easy win. Hey. Well. Huh? Uh, where did that fly off to? Alright. Yes! Oh, isn't this somewhere new? Eh, just be careful, okay? The distortion is growing much stronger the deeper we go. Free item. One blank card. Alright, next area. Isn't that. Ah, that is. Oh, that's the treasure. Ah. Uh... Just as I expected, Madarame. Means... And the treasure's behind him. Yeah, it's kind of hard to tell from here. Let's get a closer look. Focus. Oh, there's a whole big area in between here and there. Hey. Oh, man, fuck off. I want to go over there. There it is. Doesn't it look a bit hazy? For the time being. Once we send the card and make Matarame aware it'll be stolen, it'll materialize like Yoo-hoo! I wonder what form it will take. Who knows? That is something like a self-portrait. The source of what distorted Matarame's reality this much. So, what now? Think it's safe to say we got a root set? Hmm. We know where the treasure is, but I'm not sure that we've necessarily secured the route. Huh? Why is that? You must be talking about the infrared lasers surrounding it. That, and the outer perimeter is swarming with guards. Forcing our way through will be difficult. So we'll need to find a way to steal it, too. <sighs> this is tougher than it was with Kamoshida. We just have to make one final push. Let's check this floor. All right, there's a safe room to our left. Probably should save there since I've been doing some pretty dumb shit. Can 
can now travel to the main hall. Let's do it. In like an hour. Another security room we're gonna need a password for. Whoa! Yeah! Hey, we're gonna need a password for this one. What do you wanna do? Yeah, let's open all the shutters. Only Lord Madarame can access this terminal due to maximum security protocol. The heck? There was no point in even coming here then. Hmm, it seems disabling the infrared lasers is not within the realm of possibility for us. Hey! Let's try the other ones. Let's shut down the main power. What is the meaning of this? Uh, I'm not sure. It seems we've lost power. The backup generator should bring it up again in no time. What a nasty surprise. Hmm, could this also be, hey, someone? <laughs> yes, and the infrared lasers remained active even during the power outage. So, we'll only be able to turn the power off in there for a few seconds. Wait! Wait a second, aren't those guards that just ran out heading this way? Yes. Ah, so you're the ones who tampered with the electricity. <laughs> ah, we got company. Are you weak too? Persona! Die! Get ready! Go! Sorry! Ah. Oof. Come! Don't you know what? Cobra Tengu! Resist that. Persona! Oh, electric. Cool. Thousand tuned for experience. Uh. Whew, that was a surprise. All I really managed to do is open the shutters. Indeed. On top of that, we can only turn the lights off briefly while the lasers remain unaffected. Hmm. Yes, we'll just have to see it's past those shutters. I can see it. any Here. Right. Pass the baton and follow up. This is a holdup. Slice it to pieces. This will end. 
gotta heal after this again. Ooh, right. Fuck. Oh, I'm glad I fucking saved. Item? We need to use this. It's too risky not to. Yeah, Trevor would've got hit there, he died. Why did I do that? Why am I, why am I so dumb? There's still Let's open it. Let's open that. Oh. Alright, we're down to six. Zen outfit. Equipment. Let's see what we can do. Ooh. Zen outfit is stronger than Nightwatch armor. Is 30 HP? Can't use any of these yet. That's my agility too, so let's put that on. Night watch armor on you. Armor, unisex? No. I don't have any female clothes. Whatever. Deuce Coast is definitely better than what he's got on now. I'm gonna guess this takes us to the last soul gem. Whatever the hell they're called, we'll see it. Oh, it just takes us here, huh? That's probably the right play. Oh, that's right, it's gonna be right here behind an enemy. Whoa! Oh, they got shadows here too. I can feel seal pe see past the store. It might be a pain to get our hands on it though. We're gonna, we're going. What do you want to do? Nice job. Holy shit. Hella dodges. Persona! Kushi Mitama! Have no Uzume! Hmm. Make it through. All according to plan. 
Persona! Die! Fucking Persona! Captain Kid! Knock him back down again, that's all we can do right now. He blocks this. Fuck. Let's go. Persona! Roll the ground! Nice going, Skull. Time for some pain. Okay, guys. Let's go! Oh, my fucking god. He can't tell who's who. That's really bad. We gotta knock him down for a sec. Give me my cue, Joker. Uh, of course. We might die here. Oh my fucking god. Fuck that miss. Fox, your health is low. Watch out. This isn't it. Next up. Some band aids. It's time. There. There we go. I shall push you to the shore. In trouble. Someone pick them up. Oh my god. Fucking God. Please. Please. I'm fucking dead. Ooh. There. Please let me get one hit off. Please dodge this. Oh my fucking thank you. Heal myself like a lot right now. Using it. Yeah. 
think it through. Kanagi, you're mine. Great! Next move! That hits, uh, it's fucking... Run. Oh my god, I did... <sighs> did it again, holy shit. This isn't it. Can't hit the enemy Let's go. spot right now. Start the battle. I don't want to get knocked that far out. All right, new plan. Okay. Are you fucking kidding me? Damn. Too dizzy. He's dizzy. He's going to miss a lot more now. Using. Whoa. Ready when you are. Okay. What? We end this now. Let's just do this. Much thanks. Thanks. Let's go. Kofa Tengu. Perfect. I am thou. I wish I could. Uh, I wish I could. I wish I could have got Joker next. Cause I could have done cross slash and got a humongous technical. I still got a pretty good bit of damage there. Down. Let's go, Captain! 
Perfect. Persona. There. Nice. Your game is worked. Please dodge this. Those of us. All right. Only Joker dodge that, please. What are you doing? Oh, nice. There we go. Oh, even better. Yuji, hopefully get his turn. Of course I don't. Joker, please dodge that. Oh my fucking god. Oh, and I'm fucking dead again. Nice. Joker, you're hurt. Persona. Don't get reckless now. Go down. Really? Come on, Joker. Oh, it's some dizzy. Whatever. How could they be this strong? Oh. All right, I'm gonna be right back. I'm gonna restart this battle again. So, the game is over. Let's do this again. Persona. Some other way. Using it. Saw that. Whoa! That's how true phantom thieves do it. Out 
maybe not. Go down! Oh, not down! That was incredible, Joker! This one. Be okay now. Sorry! We've got several casualties. This is bad! Joker's brainwashed! He can't tell who's who! Yeah. On the ground! Nice going, Skull! Okay! A lot easier than I thought. But boy, did I get fucked up. Last one. Another... Alright, what does this one do? Yeah, I should probably heal. The cognition here is weak.
Focus. Treasure chest. This is what thievery. Huh. A powerful enemy. Persona. It's not wise to fight head Go on. Go down. Woo! Looking cool, Joker. Go ahead. It's I not got over this. yet. Flip of Persona. Captain Kid. You did it, Skull. What are you weak to again? Her skills won't work, so be careful. Fire. Up to you, man. To the second Persona. What's up, Cuddles? Pinky boy. No so sort of move. Child. Show me your true form. All right, Persona. Something else. Scorpions. You can hit the weakness. Let's go. We want to make party. You don't want to skip. Go him on. Strike. I'm two to one. Defeated two foes. Just stay don't there. Don't stop now. Ah, oh, fuck me. Thirteen hundred dollars. Ain't shit. Yes, victory. Yeah, victory. Okay. Some kind of security room too. No, it's most likely where all the mechanisms in the exhibition hall are controlled from. Given the number of hanging works, it would make sense to have a room dedicated to controlling them. The observational skills of an artist are out of this world. Can I steal this, please? Fuck. Ah. Hmm. You think this moves the wires for all the hanging art? Looks like Fox's deduction was on point. I have something. Hmm? Hmm. What's up? Just a window? Is it just a window? Uh can I not do anything else? Hmm? Ain't this right above the treasure? No, oh, look, there aren't any lasers above it. Yeah, this is quite a large hole in their security. But what do we do? Jump down and retrieve it? Man. We wouldn't be able to get out if we did that, though. Look up. Oh. A crane with a hook. Didn't we see something earlier that looked like it could be a set of controls for that crane? Let's go back and check it out. Looks like this is it. Joker, give it a try. Wait! Stop, they'll notice if you keep that up. Get back there. Go, go, go. Hmm. Hmm, this could be useful. Do you plan on descending on that hook? Will they not spot you the moment you were lowered down? No, not necessarily. There's something I can do to make sure that doesn't happen. The darkness. Nice. All right, we we're able to turn the lights off over in that control room. Hold a moment. Only for a few seconds, though. There would be not enough. There would not be enough time to make it all the way here. I've got a good idea. That's why we're gonna split up tasks and work together to pull off this heist. One person will shut the power off here, and one person will lower the crane, and I'll grab the treasure. 
Hey, you sure that's gonna work? Seems like they'd realize what's going on at some point. Sometimes bold moves have the greatest payout unless someone has a better idea. Sounds good to me. Now then. All right, so our infiltration route is secured. We got all of the will seeds. We got our asses kicked four times. It. It's okay, we can leave them. We have an We've important matter to discuss. to discuss regarding your rehabilitation. Hmm. There you are, inmate. Our master admires the progress of your rehabilitation, and hence has given you use of a special ritual. It's the electric chair, used to sacrifice personas and transmutate them into high-level items. Any further questions regarding this ritual can be directed toward our master himself. He's apparently gonna consider making even more rituals if your rehabilitation goes as planned. Work hard for it, inmate. Wait, was that really it? Did you bring me in here for nothing, guys? Come on. No slacking off. What is the matter? Hmm, is something wrong? You appear to be lost in thought. Shall we be off? Excellent. No problems all around. Shall we get going? Oh, did you just spin that? Alright, we made it over... Way over what we normally... What do you want to do? Way over what I wanted to make, so... We've secured our route to the treasure. Do you want to get out of here? Yep. All right, that settles it. Fascinating. Yes! Yeah! Ah, you're back. Okay. You did great today. You tired? All we have to do now is send the calling card to Matarame. All right, it's finally time. Now we gotta decide. All we gotta do is decide how, when we're gonna do it. Should we talk to Yusuke about this first? Uh, why? I mean, Matarame was his teacher. It's not our place to be citing something like this. Oh yeah. Let's talk to Yusuke. Yeah, this problem's bigger than all three of us. Anyway, how about we all meet up at the hideout? Yep, sounds good. Saturday, not Sunday. I should write something. Hey, hey! Okay, so we have Mega Fertilizer because I decided to get it. Does this give more? Oh. Yes. All right, how much does that one give differently?
to be saved. It tells me what I get. Alright, so I would have got a plus five here instead of a three or four. Actually got, but I got more than I should than I get from the other one, so that's good. We're gonna finish this movie. They're all dead. How could who could have done this? The larvae. It must have infected them. Got into their brains. We need to find those samples, Skullsy, fast. <sighs> Same. Uh... Guts up by three. Okay. Well then. All right, so Sunday we have to do. Check the TV first. Muscle Plus set. Uh, what's the other one? Outdoors kit. Yeah, no, I don't want any of these. Hey, hey. Today's Sunday, so we're going to be... Everything resets tomorrow, all the drink things. Oh look, it's Yusuke, standing very creepily. To... Wait, why do you have so many keys? Yusuke, do those go to the sex dungeon? Alright, let's get this. We get for this knowledge, uh, kindness. Okay. Here we go. Have there been any changes to your health? I want to check you out just in case. I don't have any patience. Could you stop by the clinic? Um, decide later. Am I the death of that person? Yeah, I do. Okay, cool. Go right away. <sighs> the warmer it gets, the stranger people act. Like that preferred high school teacher. Has anyone ever studied, studied the correlation between the rise in temperature and the, ri the rise in weirdos? You came because you saw my messages, right? 
I want to do a clinical trial. I made some more refinements to the medicine. Can I have you come in? Well then. That's to do it. Oh. And? So why come here? Aren't you under the care of another hospital? I've heard rumors about this place. I'd like you to examine her. She was diagnosed with bronchitis, but the medicine she was given hasn't been working at all. She has a fever that won't go away, and she's losing weight because she's not hungry. A young girl losing weight is definitely not good. You should go to a bigger hospital. I can't provide a thorough examination here. We've been going to, the, to a big hospital, a university hospital in East Shinjuku. But all they tell us is that it's persistent bronchitis. <laughs> a university hospital in East Shinjuku? The doctor there performs exam like he's on an assembly line. I think he's famous or something. A famous doctor, huh? I'm just a general pac practitioner out here in the sticks. As you can see, I don't even have any staff. Wait, I've heard there's a medicine that can only be acquired here. Please, I'll pay you. Please, at least just examine her. Hey! Hold on. Child... Death noises in the background. Doctor, my chest really hurts. Doctor Takemi will help you. What? What? Doctor, please. <sighs> My child's gonna die. Hmm. Is your vision blurry? How about your throat? Does it hurt? Hmm. No signs of swelling. Are you sure you've told me everything about her symptoms and treatments you've tried so far? Yes, I'm sure. Hmm. Hello? Is Dr. Schweitzer there? There's something I'd like to ask him about a case that was in last month's medical journal. I see. Guess the ones in stock will have to do. There's a shelf by the by the reception desk. Bring the contents of the second drawer into the exam room. You'll need to help me administer the medicine. Also, bring the beaker with the red label in the fridge, a towel, wash basin, and a measuring spoon. Fine. Well, what are you waiting for? Get moving. Ah, thank you so much. I didn't expect her to recover so quickly. Hmm. It was a very unique strain of an infectious disease. It can't be detected by conventional exams. I've temporarily suppressed the symptoms. We'll make adjustments as her condition improves. Okay, that'll be one million yen for today. A million yen? That's outrageous. You're completely taking advantage of... I mean, alright, I agreed to pay. You don't take credit cards, do you? I'll go withdraw some cash right now. <laughs> huh, wait, you're actually gonna pay? By the way, that famous doctor you mentioned earlier? Was it medical chief of staff? Oh, Yamada? Yes, are you familiar with him? I knew it. In that case, I'll make this free of charge. F free? <laughs> oh, you seem happy. <laughs> Doesn't it feel good? Treating his patient without permission? By the way... By the way, thanks to your outburst earlier, I'm going to perform a very special exam on you today. I have a bad heart, you see. So, is he your assistant? He seems awfully young. Oh yeah, my assistant guinea pig. He's about to put in a lot of hard work today, aren't you? Alright. Rank 4... Um, doctor, can I go back to school now? Not for a while. You need to start eating and regaining your strength first. Can you do that for me? Yes, thank you, doctor. Don't mention it. Your turn. I wonder what kind of response you'll have this time. Maybe you won't even be able to make it home. Guts. Bye. Okay, good work today. How are you feeling now? Today's drug was kind of a rough one, huh? But maybe it was just what my careless little guinea pig deserved, huh? Especially after approving that girl's consultation without my permission. 
I will reflect on my mistakes. Good boy. But I'm only letting this go today. Don't pull anything like that again. The drug does seem to be more stable compared to the early stages, though. It's probably thanks to your cooperation. Feels like I'm almost there, so... I'm trying to die just yet, okay? Ah, you're back. Hey! Free to ask the airsoft guy about the paper bag. Listen here, kitty cat, shut the fuck up. We have things to do that are more important. Like, go talk to this guy and rank up Sun to rank 2 and get some free charm. Hey, there's a guy over there playing guitar. Please, consider what I have to say. Good evening. Help him out today? Right away, then. Everyone. Passing on the societal ills we have created we have created to the next generation is not right. It will take time to solve this problem. However, we must start by making small changes. You. I hope you gleaned something useful from today's speech. Regardless of the audience's size, you must convey your thoughts as if you're talking one-on-one. -on -one. By the way, I forgot to ask you last time we spoke, why do you want to become a politician? Hmm. To change the world. Hmm? Ambitious, indeed, if, if a little ambiguous. Well, I'm sure you'll iron out the details as you go along. May I ask you one more question? What kind of politician do you want to be? One with conviction. Yes, don't ever forget that. Although, what's important is what lies within. You're right. Allow me to give you some advice. If you aspire to get into politics, you may must possess a central philosophy. What is it that you want to accomplish? That is the foundation of a great speech. You do well to remember that. Hmm. That was helpful. I'm glad. By the way, my philosophy is... Very well. Never give up until your voice is heard. To get your message across, be tenacious in conveying your thoughts to the audience. Have a firm point of view and communicate it clearly. That's the first rule of negotiating. <laughs> you have me reliving the fighting spirit I had when I first became a politician. Great two. Diplomacy. Hey, ask for more money. All right. Hey, get the hell out of here, no good Tora. Mm. All right, I am no good. Ah, my apologies. We're done for today. Free charm. I, I shall room. ask you again another time. Thanks for all your hard work. I'll see you next time. I'll... Hey, I wanted to thank you for today. I'm sorry you had to see me acting like such a coward right after I gave you that self-important lecture, too. But I'm quite a stubborn individual myself. I hope today's incident was at least a good example of what not to do, but... What do you think? Did I take... Did you take anything useful from it? It was helpful. That's a relief. I have to say, it was most nostalgic for me. It reminded me of my early years. I hope our talks from now on will keep giving you the direction you need. Well, I hope to see you again soon. You ride this train at this time too. <laughs> What a coincidence. We finished investigating the palace. All that's left is the calling card. When are you going to send it? Uh, after we prepare. So the more important it is, the more cautious we should be. You have a point. You are dependable as I thought. I'll leave the timing of the calling card in your care.
Oh, have you heard? Madarame, the maestro from the art world. The maestro. Artists with that good of an eye are rare in Japan. I wonder if he has a Synthiasia. Yes, regarding Synthiasia, one of the many English terms that come from Greek root words. Haven't heard of it? It's a condition where your senses can cross over each other like seeing music as color. There are all kinds of varieties, though. Some sense combinations are more common than others. We call people who experience this phenomenon... I'm not even going to try to figure out how to say that. Well, your number's up. The root words of Synthiasia are S are Sin and Atheist. What do they mean? Um... Atheist, huh? That's a little like the word aesthetics. I wonder if it means... Mm, yes, that's it. that's it. Sounds like we know the definition of the root words. So that means the full word basically means... Senses coming together. I mean, she basically said that in the question. This is it. Good. You've been studying. Unfortunately, it is something you have to be born with. You can't learn it. Some of the geniuses over the course of history have had synthesia. The composer Franz Liszt instructed his orchestra to play the color purple. <laughs> the poet Arthur Rimbaud was also say to see colors in letters. Oh, oh, what? That's a neat. Nice going. Seeing colors and sounds and letters, and feeling shapes and flavors and numbers. The geniuses and common people see the world differently. Were you able to understand that? I see. Although the reason Madarame sees the world differently is because of his distorted desires. Hey! Alright, we got to get... Right. Courtyard first. Drink machine. Oh. Oh. So these don't have anything. All the same, right? Oh, oh no, they're not. So this third one got it then. That's too far. Where's the door? Right here. Welcome. We want to get. We can afford all of them, so we're gonna get all of them now. We don't have to come back if we need them later. We can now take him down, yes? Madarame is going to be a changed man. There won't be any way to revert it, though. Are you sure you're okay with that? I have thought it over carefully. And I cannot think of a future in which he does not pay his dues. 
He has preyed not only on the art world, but on countless talents. All right. I apologize for making you do this. Not at all. We just didn't want to impose if you weren't feeling up to it, Yusuke. But if you're already determined to do it, then there's nothing more for us to say. If I recall, our next step is sending a calling card, correct? <laughs> what a suave maneuver. It's not about acting cool. The calling card is a way to trigger a change in his cognition. A change in cognition? Uh, that reminds me, you went through some trouble regarding that before. Ah, you must be talking about when we forced open that security gate in the courtyard. The palace is a cognitive world, so changing its ruler's cognition changes the topography, I think. Very nicely put, Lady On. You're absolutely correct. This will be a vital tactic from here forward. Actually, may I ask a truly basic question? You continue to mention cognition quite readily. But why does this world formed from materialized cognitions even exist to begin with? Don't tell me. Has it always existed while we go about our daily lives completely oblivious? Honestly, I'm not sure. At the very least, I know it existed before the Kamoshida incident, but that's all. I see. Crap, you totally caught me off guard with that. It's kind of weird thinking there might be whole worlds we just don't know a damn thing about. Did the thought ever cross your mind? Uh, no? Don't be so anxious. You don't even know everything about the city you live in, after all. All that's important is that we know how to make use of that world and how to traverse it. Then it's decided. Let's prepare the calling card at once. Nah, Cuddles, we still went to school. A calling card. We can't bring a. We take it seriously. Unneeded suspicion to ourselves. We might get caught by the school council president. Oh no. He is famous after all. He has often received slanderous letters till now as well. He'll know best whether the crime written on it is for real or not. Wait, are you going to write it again, Ryuji? That last one was questionable at best. You should do it then, Yusuke. Oh, make it really artistic and stuff! No, it'll end with him figuring it out. He knows my drawing and writing styles all too well. Oh, then I'll think it up and you make it cooler. Designing a calling card. Hmm. Interesting. It shall become proof that the Phantom Thieves do exist. It's decided then. Great! All that's left is to make the treasure ours. You guys better come fully prepared. Yo, I tried changing the cat the chat icon. Looks the same to me. Maybe it's just for the group and doesn't show up in here. Well, you should take a look later. It's the Phantom Thieves logo I had Yusuke draw for us. The calling card turned out great because of him too. Anyways, anyways, this is the first job for the Phantom Thieves. Really can't screw this one up. I'm not understand understanding anything, I assure you. Underestimating. And make sure Yusuke gets a lot of rest today, okay? Mm-hmm. Hey! You have to read this book. Make sure you close up. Ah, oh, the rich quaked in fear as the poor rejoiced. Wow! Gaimon was a thief without peer, so he was a hero of the common people, huh? Hey, hey! Didn't get very far in the book because we don't have speed reading yet. Hey! Ah, 
finish that book now. Hmm? Striking a pose of defiance with tobacco pipe in hand, he truly looked like a great thief. Wow! Oh! <laughs> Gus plus five. Ooh. Still no uh, upgrade though. Let's begin. First, I have an announcement about an upcoming school event. As a part of a city beautification project, the entire school will be participating in a public cleanup campaign. That means we're going to go to Inokashira Park to pick up trash. Okay, quiet down. Settle down. The cleanup will take place next week on the 30th. All students are to wear their gym uniforms during the event, so don't forget to dress the part. You guys hear about this... This cleanup bullshit? I guess it's the principal's idea. Damage control after Kama, she has scandaled up the school's rep. Pretty sure scandal's not a verb. But I get what you mean. Even the counseling stuff seems like a desperate move. <sighs> They're scrambling. All the girls in our class have been freaking out over this new guy, too. I've been hearing Maruki's hot, kind, sensitive, basically everyone thinks he's their type. Oh, I guess he's pretty popular then. Oh yeah, did you guys go to his counseling yet? Oh shit, I forgot. But I don't know, I don't really feel like going. You know what I mean, right? I already went! What? You should just go already. Well, you can't today, but soon. If your slacking draws attention to us, we're the ones who'll have to pay for it. Ah, fine. Pardon me, sir. There's a matter we need to notify you about. When are we boning the teacher? That's for la That's later. That's like after this palace. Please excuse me for a moment. Like at best. What is it? There's a cutscene you have to go through to even unlock that confidant. We found this outside. A letter? It's, uh... Sir Ichiryusai Matarame, a great sinner of vanity whose talent has been exhausted. You are an artist who uses his authority to shamelessly steal the ideas of his pupils. We have decided to make you confess all your crimes with your own mouth. We will take your distorted desires without fail from the Phantom Thieves. Who's doing is this? We don't know. The same letter has been posted everywhere. What about scandal, the scandal, 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 scandal. There were no signs of the culprit. All we saw was a cat in the recordings. Remove these at once! Of course. Hmm. Um... <sighs> what now? It's about this affecting the exhibit. We believe it's just a prank, but what of the mass media? Are you insinuating that this slander is true? Of course not! Damn brats doing, isn't it? Well, it means nothing. They'll only be able to do as they please until this exhibit is over. Will that do? Yup, it was perfect. The composition was way cooler too. The treasure should appear right about now. You better enjoy the air of freedom while you still can, old man. Anyways, did you guys check online? People are already talking about that calling card. We'll show them. We're gonna surprise them all. I'm sure you know, but we only get one shot to pull this off. Ah, let's do this. It'll be fine. We managed last time, too. 
You have no reservations about this either, right, Yusuke? Of course not. We'll do this. Sphere in here seems significantly different. I mean, we did basically declare war on him by sending that card. Ah, there's nothing well, left then. to fear. We've secured a route and we've are and we're ready to go. We'll take the treasure in style. It seems there are vermin sniffing around here, but we'll have to endure until the exhibit ends. Hm. Those impertinent whelps, I'll make them regret ever angering me. It looks like. What a fucking loser can't even do art by himself. He can't even sling his dick into some paint and onto a canvas on his own. It seems attacking from this direction will not be easy. Finally time. There will be no turning back once we begin the operation. And if worse comes to worse, we might have to fight. Joker! That's right, are you ready, Joker? Ready as I'll ever be. Yes! Alright, everyone to your positions. There's an enemy inside, just as expected. I mean, we've done a ton in here. It ain't surprising. Anyway, I'm gonna try and draw it out, so I'll leave the switch to you guys. Will you be okay? What if it catches up to you? <laughs> Don't underestimate an ex-runner. I'm definitely gonna shake it off. Hey! There's some weird people over here! Hey! I need some help! Hmm? What's the matter? You better make it, Skull. Is this good? Yeah, it's perfect. You seem to be enjoying this. Only the best can appreciate these critical moments. Plus, this feels like we're really phantom thieves. We'll be counting on you, Mona. And Panther as well. There's Fox's signal. That means they're ready to go. Good luck, everyone. Let's do this. Joker, no! Sorry for the wait. My bad. It took me ages to get that guy off my trail. Wait, where's Mona? Let's go. Oh no. How's that for a skilled plan? 
That was amazing! Lord Matarame, the piece is gone! How dare those vermin! Now, corner them like the rats they are! Lock all the doors at once, they have nowhere to run! Hey. Uh, so, how did the treasure turn out being? I'm guessing it's a painting based on the shape. We can look into that later for now, and we must escape. Yep, it's time to go! Dude, no way, it's not opening? Seriously? I heard, sir, I heard sounds come from the crane. Check up above. Whoa. Wow, what do we do now? You don't got a plan about how to get out of here? What kind of master thief are you? In any case, let us search for another way out. We must escape. Uh. I ain't shit. We're gonna make up this way. Oh, yeah, I know where we're going. Out the window. Let me examine the window game, please. Oh, a window, but where'd it go? go? Now is no time to be lost in thought. Whoa, this shit's real high up. But at least we're outside. Is there a way down out here? See it. Is this another portal to an unknown destination? We don't have time to lose. Just go through it. Now's our chance. For real? But I guess there's no other way. Is this the courtyard? I knew it. All that security would have been meaningless if it just led back inside. It seems we managed to escape their siege. Dude, why is Mona getting excited now of all times? I just can't take it anymore. Let's take a look at this treasure. I don't have time for that. Treasure! Huh? This is the treasure? Get back! Uh -huh. Whoa! Meddlesome vermin. Is this what you're looking for? How dare you try to trap me like some kind of mouse! So you had a fake prepped, huh? Counterfeits are accepted in the world of Japanese art. What made you change like this? Is it because you became famous? Can't you understand how much it pains me to inquire about the crimes of my foster father? Now that I think back, the only reason why I took you in was due to my ties with your mother. That woman never lost her passion for painting, even after her husband died. Her skills and talents were quite astonishing. That's why I decided to look after her. Your mother and the artwork she created, they're all my works of art! How low can you oh, sink? Oh, thief. I suppose I can grant you a gift before you die. A glimpse of the genuine Sayuri. Genuine? That's the real Sayuri? This can't be. Mom. Huh? Indeed it is! This was painted by your mother. It's a portrait of herself. A woman who knew her death was coming painted her last wishes for the son she would leave behind. That is the truth behind the mystery of Sayuri's expression! You stole something that personal? I knew at first glance. I knew it'd be a huge success if I added a touch to the painting and announced it under my name. But the baby in the picture... Why did you paint over it? It was all to stage it. If the babe is erased, the reason for the woman's expression will become a mystery. 
That is what the general public is drawn to. Each of those parasitic critics wrote the same thing. I always felt something was off about all this. Now I know what it is. If you really treasured that painting, you wouldn't even think about replicating it for profit. a real treasure? Your true skills are nothing more than those scribbles on that fake! It makes me laugh, asshole! So you'll defy me no matter what? Well then, since you're my work of art, Yusuke, I'm going to reap you for the sake of my future, along with those insolent friends of yours there. I can't believe you're treating both mother and son like they're objects! You're inhuman! Fox? I've heard that you destroy your art once they outlive their usefulness. Did that include my mother as well? She just so happened to have a seizure in front of me. That's when a thought crossed my mind. If I don't call for help and leave her be, I could obtain her painting without any strings attached. No. You let her die? She was physically weak. No one would doubt if she just dropped dead because of a seizure. Above all, Yusuke, didn't you think it was odd that I discovered your talent when you were only three? The reason why I kept you around was to keep you from realizing the truth behind Sayori! You killed her. The artistic talents you inherited from your mother were a delightful miscalculation, though. If I'm to steal ideas, it's much easier robbing the future of brats who won't talk back than adults. It's thanks to you that I came up with the idea. You have my gratitude. <laughs> Yusuke? I thank you, Madarame. Every reason for me to forgive you has disappeared without a trace at this very moment. You aren't some rotten artist. You're a despicable fiend who wears the skin of an artist. All you good-for-nothings barging into my museum and doing whatever the hell you want! Those who have the connections make the rules. Those who don't, follow them. Not to mention, the value of art is all subjective. I make the rules of the art scene. I am the supreme being. I am the god of the art world! This isn't good. Get back! others for your own despicable desires, Madarame. Ew. You aren't even worth the art you create! Joker, Persona! There's no telling what he'll try! A copy of. All right. That's not gonna do much. Attack up. Persona! Persona! It heals the top too. Ooh, this is my other self. Oh. 
Mm, let's go. Let's try something different then. Kanagi. Flash. Yeah. They regenerated? Damn it. Those things can come back if we don't take them down at once? Stupid brats. <laughs> Joker, Flip your defense persona. got lower. Get ready! Let's do this! You anger me! Dodge? Ooh. Let's go. Prepare yourself. Oh, physical heals the mouth. Persona! Something else. I know who's the man. Okay. This is the ultimate form of ours. What is this attack? There has to be more than just our color changing. We should be cautious. Stupid friends. Go. Your defense is dropped. No, this is worth it. Persona! Take this! You anger me! He gets knocked here, right? Dodge, please. Come on, dude. Your Come on, bro. I am down. Ranting. Taste the wrath of all those you preyed upon. That did like five damage. I'm the great artist Madarame. If you brats can't fathom that, then you'll witness it for yourselves. Behold my mastercraft. Hmm. Oh, what the fuck? What is this? I don't remember this. I see. Creating duplicates is his specialty. Persona! Kanagi! Boss! Go! Is this how you show your gratitude to the man who raised you? Silence! Don't waste your breath! Joker! Persona! Your defense got lowered! Persona! Damn, Sarmi! That's gonna hit one of them. Everyone okay? Oh, wow, that was There's a big a fucking mistake. Someone heal her! I'm using it! Thank you. <laughs> Persona! Okay, we're gonna have to do some, uh... Oh, nice one, we got some things to do here. Lend me a hand. Not yes. over yet. Persona! Kofa Tengu! You're mine. Ooh, looking cool, Joker! Do it! I'll get on to the second person! Flip him, Persona! That's that one out. Joker, your defense got lower. Uh, 
Hmm. I think we should just use this. Yeah, that was probably the right call. I could have burned him, but I couldn't probably like someone who can hit everyone. Yeah, it's basically like a waste of time. Rats! I fiery rage shall reduce you all to mere ashes! Take this! I won't help! Oh my fucking god. Oh wait, they're all the same typing now. Your defense has dropped! Let's go! Sona! That's not right. Persona! Uh, are they gonna turn it or are they just gonna resist it? Good question. Joker, yeah, they returned okay? it. That was bad. Joker's frozen. He can't move like this. This one. All right. Hit. Dead. Persona. Joker, your defense got lower. Fire this time. Persona! Knock that one out. Persona! Can't actually. This is my other self. Ah, oh, nice one, Fox. Persona, go him on. Oh, nice one, Fox. I am thou. Go him on, strike! Oh, nice that one, work. Fox. I won't forgive you. Damn brass! Oh, I oh. Come on, you gotta hold on. Anger me. Yeah, I lose. <sighs> Alright, got myself frozen. That was my fault. That was dumb. Skip, 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 skip. <sighs> Restart the battle. I am a big dumb bitch. You're not wrong. Now, you. Joker, don't Let's go. Focus. There's no telling what he'll try. How do you know who's man? Go down. Get some damage off here. I actually did the eyes first. Yeah, that was really easy. Get ready. Persona. Mm. Right. 
close. He's gonna get a res- Knock out. Alright. We're gonna do a bunch of baton passes. start with what? I didn't want to start with focus the original yeah Persona. you'll see I have a, I have a plan Don't rush it I have a plan for this Persona. there Persona. let's go captain You'll see in just a second what I'm about to do. Just a single fire attack on you. Oh, we can't swap the use case, so we're gonna go straight here. Hold on. It's tough. We've got some options, but we better find a weakness. Not this. Persona! Uh, we only have. Yeah, that's a lot of damage right there. Persona! Stop this! Is this how this Perfect. Go in on strike! Alright. Oh, nice one, Fox. Then we have the baton and Persona. I won't forgive you. Damn. Take this. So basically, what I'm gonna try to do is I'm gonna try to go through all of the. Um... Stop it, you brats! Or else. You think we'll be daunted by such threats? I won't I'm gonna go through you. all of the um clones to get baton passes to knock choice. him out. I won't forgive you. My brilliant strikes like a flash of lightning. And now you'll taste it for yourselves. Take this! You I'm just gonna make another fake. It's gonna share one of the oh no. okay. Panther's in trouble! Someone heal Jump. her! Let's go. Hm. Alright, now watch this. Persona! I'm in trouble. Coming. Pop this one. See that again, I'm in trouble. Um Persona! Pop this one. I'm in trouble. Baton pass. You got it. Yes. Pass the baton and follow up. I am thou. Go on. Hit this one's weakness. Oh, nice one, Fox. Baton pass to Joker. Get the Persona. Plus. 
Oh my god, he has like... Oh my god, fuck, he still has HP! Okay, never mind. I won't forgive you. You dare to fight Damn brass. Please dodge. Ooh, five health. Okay. Everyone, watch your health. Hm. Thank you. Thanks. There we go. That plan worked this time. I wasted an item, but I get all this money, so it's not too big of a deal. All right. Level that was mostly just for safety. No one cares for true art. All they want are easily recognizable brands. I'm a victim in this too. Wouldn't you agree? Excuses now? The art world revolves around money after all. You can't rise up without any money. I just didn't want to return to that life. A fiend like you has no right to speak about the world of art. You're done for, along with this whole wretched world! <laughs> no, please! Just don't kill me! <laughs> Return to yourself in reality and confess your crimes. All of them. You're not going to kill me? Swear it! <laughs> All right! He ain't All wrong right. about what? What about the other one, though? The one with the black mask? Huh? Who? A black mask? Wait, who's he talking about? It can't be. There was another intruder besides us within this palace? There's no time! Hurry! Get on! Hey, Yusuke! What should I do? Put an end to all this and use your own artwork for once. Yusuke! No, wait, please! Yusuke! Yusuke! has been deleted. Oh, the art world is nothing but money and favors? People started getting suspicious of it's us. It's like everything, We though. should leave at once. Yusuke, come on! Right. Goodbye, Sensei. I guess the mission was a success. All that's left is to see if he had a change of heart or not. Ah, oh, so bitter! Why'd you get it black? Sayuri. You're not gonna get all teary-eyed and say stuff like, Mom, are ya? To think that this painting was the source of Matarame's distorted desires. The only saving grace is that my mother won't know of what transpired. The genuine painting at his atelier has been altered after all. Ironic as it may be, this one here is her true self-portrait now. It's a wonderful painting. And although it took some time, it's in your hands now, Yusuke. I'm thankful for it. However, it's impossible for this painting to be acknowledged by society anymore. Uh, that's a shame. Indeed. I must inherit my mother's wishes and improve myself even further. So, this is my mother. There's no way that I would remember her face clearly, but... I was right about the rush of emotion I felt when I saw this painting. Oh. 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 
Stop that! You're so vulgar, Ryuji. So, what are you gonna do now? We're gonna keep targeting big shots. Why do you do such things? It's to get back at scumbags and, like, society in general. We also want to give courage to the people that are suffering because of selfish adults. Courage, huh? What good does that do? You mean the courage to stand up for themselves, correct? Will acquiring that make them happy? Probably. Yeah. There's no knowing whether it'll turn out good for everyone or not. Still, we won't know unless we give it a try. In other words, it all depends on the person, hmm? And the same can be said about myself right now. I also suffered because of an adult selfish act. Moreover, if we investigate these palaces, it may expand my artistic repertoire. You really only think about art, huh? You're impressive. Well, I won't take part in any inelegant plans, all right? No worries, I've got us covered. Plus, we have a rule that says we always have to decide on a target unanimously. How about it, Joker? We can give our calling cards a lot more oomph if we have Yusuke on our team. He would make a great member. I will try and live up to those expectations. At any rate, I'm curious. Another intruder besides us, huh? Our only clue is a black mask, so that doesn't necessarily mean it's just one person, right? But there's no way to check anymore. The palace is gone. I'll try probing Matarame. I may be able to learn something from him. Are you sure? I mean... I'll contact you all if anything turns up. We should probably exchange our contact info with you then. An artist and a phantom thief. Well, it seems I'll be engaging in two trades from here on. Very well. All right, man. Good night. Once after all. Still, the incident about this other intruder does concern me a little. Not only have we dealt with our second big target, we even have a new addition to the team. Goodness, things are going so well. Yeah, we're on a roll. <laughs> Could the day our name becomes common knowledge be nigh? But I have to say, you sure are something special. This is our fifth Persona user. It'll help broaden our battle strategies as well. Besides, having an eye for beauty is a must for Phantom Thieves. We're lucky to have Yusuke. An artist is a talent you rarely come across. I mean, he is a bit strange, but still. An artist, huh? What kind of person do you think I was? There's no way I'd turn out to be some bad guy in the end, right? I get so engrossed with the embodiment of human desires. And that's not all. When it comes to the metaverse, I'm the only one who can transform into a car. I'm special, but it's still odd. Who could I actually be? Hmm, probably a human. You really think so? <sighs> what a half-assed answer. Well, there's no way a dashing, honorable rogue like me could be evil. A man who saves those in trouble in the West, while punishing evildoers who may lurk in the East. A man who chastises people that smoke inside in the South, while saving bullied cats in the North. A man who has a sturdy body, and vows to always do one good deed a day, be it rain or shine. I'm that kind of ideal person. Or so I hope. So if I turn back to being human, surely she'll take notice of me, won't she? Uh, probably. Probably not, actually. R right! Of course that's the case. <sighs> where should I go when I become human? I wonder where she'd like to go. An amusement park. A movie theater. A fancy cafe. Shopping. What do you think?
All right, follow up attacks with All right. Morgana, that, who, whom we're never going to use again, so it doesn't really matter, actually. Yo, good job, guys. We all did our best. Allow me to express my thanks once again, because Yo was able to retrieve the painting that had been filled with my mother's love. Hearing yeah, you say that makes the whole thing worth it. Seriously. I wasn't sure you'd really want to change Madarame's heart. I'm sorry to have worried you. I have no regrets about it now. And the change of heart will happen this time, right? You worried? It's only our second time doing this, after all. By the way, I'm curious about what he said that at the end. You mean about the other intruder besides us? It was something about a black mask, yeah? That may have been nothing more than a lie. Madarame was quite deranged at that point, after all. For now, we should just wait for his change of heart in peace. Okay. I need to turn auto off because automatic chat's dumb. Alright. Let's do it. Where does that put us time wise for the game? 2251. Man! We're gonna clean the bat clean the bathroom. Well, clean the whole thing. Kindness. Mm. That should do it for now. Hey. You have expelled one who was stained in vanity. You are now one step closer to your rehabilitation. It's a delightful thing indeed. Our master is pleased. You should be honored, inmate. However, that man's remarks are concerning. It seems another has made their way into the metaverse. Hmm, is that true? That is beyond my knowledge. But your rehabilitation is progressing smoothly, that is for certain. May the devotion to your rehabilitation grow even deeper. I have high hopes for you. being he hasn't suffered a mental shutdown other than that his demeanor seems to have softened a bit to have softened a bit is that the change of heart uh, it could be I see I was curious and looked into Kamoshida as well it's as if he was an entirely different person will the same be true for sensei well, I'm sorry to have taken your time that's all I wanted to tell you. Oh, I'll try asking him about the black masked intruder from the palace when the time is right. Goodbye then, this time for sure. We meet again. It appears you're lying low lately. What's with the change? I'm acting the same as usual. Really? Is it just my imagination then? Anyhow? There are voice cutscenes right now, Greg. I'm not gonna talk over them. I wish the culprit would come forward soon. It's absurd to pretend I can do the police's job. 
I wish he considered my feelings before asking me this. It's open. Sup? Hey there. Here for a counseling session. Well, it's not like I wanted to or nothing. Uh, sorry you were forced into this, but anyway, come on in. Uh, so this is pretty awkward. Huh? Hmm, why is that? I mean, I don't really go to see teachers unless they want to chew me out for doing something wrong. Oh, I'm not a teacher here, if anything. Well, I'm here. I'm here to be on the student side. <sighs> oh, yeah? So, am I supposed to tell you about Kamashita now? Well... Uh, no. This isn't some kind of interrogation. You're free to just kick back and talk about whatever you think. Like what? How about it? Hmm, how about is there anyone in class that you like? Uh... That's eh, not exactly easy to talk about either. And it's not like there is anybody. Uh, sorry. No, oh, sorry. I just meant you're in the middle of your teenage years and all, right? High schoolers are just discovering romance and all, so... Eh, it went for you. Not exactly. <laughs> but, uh, that's just because I fell in love with my studies first. I'm sorry. I'm supposed to be hearing you up, but instead I'm just bringing down the room. Oh, how about this instead? What are you doing in your free time? On the weekend after school? Uh... Yeah, with my buds mostly, though, I just started doing that recently. Before that, I was just pissed all the time, and even before that, I was only all about the track team. Ah. Uh. So, is your leg better now? Hmm. Oh, so you know about that, too. Well, yeah, pretty much so long as I don't strain it or nothing. I see. Quite. And you really do enjoy running, don't you? I guess so. I mean, after all that training I did, it makes sense I'd like it. I'd be training constantly. Getting sweet times and meets along with everyone else. Uh, eventually, I was going to get my hands on some running scholarships to make it easier on my mom. Uh, that's all in the past now. It's cool, though. I got way more important shit to do now. More important, huh? <laughs> well, no matter what path you might have to take to get there, I hope your track dreams will still do you some good in the end. Y yeah. Uh, yeah, thanks. I know. And you know what they say, right? If you wish hard enough, your dreams can come true. What the hell? Huh? You trying to sell me some kind of line now? Oh no, this is actually a genuine phenomenon. With a lot of research going to it going into it even now. Look at it this way. What you do what you want most what do you want most in life right now? Hmm. Hmm. Well, it's something to drink, I guess. Uh. Huh? What? I looked to a coupon for a free can of apple juice at the convenience store this morning. And now I'd like you to have it. Oh, thanks. <laughs> See, your wish came true. I hey, want something to drink yeah. right now, too. Hey, Dr. Maru, I mean, Doc, anyone ever tell you you're kind of not normal? Oh, you think so? Hmm. Could that be a compliment coming from you? Uh, no. <laughs> oh. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, something happened to me the other Actually. day. I almost got kidnapped. Darn, next hey, time. Wait. Hey, what's that supposed to mean? I'm in serious trouble. I was in serious trouble, you know? Some girl with this crazy look in her eyes and she was chasing me around calling me Snowball or something. I wonder if she's been going after other cats and snatching up like she's trying to move. Hey. Try checking the fan site and see if there's anyone saying anything about it. No relevant posts. Mm. Hmm. Maybe this is just not a well-known problem yet. The only victims are cats, so I suppose it could be the case. Okay, let's go. Let's try asking around Youngin to see if we can find the culprit. What are you doing tonight, Greg? What do I have to do now? We need to go to get a request.
Oh, seven days to die. Um. Investigate Young and Jaya by talking to the residents to ID the target. Oh, wait. What's today? Did I pick up the Argonade stuff oh. here already? Yeah, I did. Back streets. Hey, hey. Focus. Why is this guy standing here gripping his nuts? Hmm? The lady looks really happy now. Is it because she had a bunch of cats? I suppose. I personally think it's a bit too much. With that, Benny gets so loud I can't sleep at night. A bunch hey. of cats. Hey, she may be talking about the catnapping case. Let's ask her for more information. Uh, I'm concerned too. You're concerned about that household as well. She suddenly brought home a massive number of cats. I wasn't sure if she was alright. It's terribly noisy at night and sh they shed everywhere. I'm worried that it's not the healthiest environment to raise those cats. Maybe there's a reason for it. Even so, I'm worried for the cats. I even told the landlord about the situation at Ino Sand's house, home, but it looks like nothing's changed. Hmm, can you hear her full name? Huh, her name? I'm not sure, I only say hello to her every now and then, so I don't know her name that well. Hmm. Doesn't like we can learn anything else from her. Let's get out of here and go over what we know so far. So here's what we learned from the mother and child. Uh, this Ino lady suddenly adopted a lot of cats. There's concern about the noise at night and shedding. Cats might be acting that way because they're stressed. Okay, we might be able to find some other clues. Let's keep investigating around young again. Why is this guy standing out here? Since the spring we're selling these fruit trays for a limited time only, give it a try. Oh, fuck off. I went to see Madarame's exhibition, but I can't tell good art but I can't tell good art is anymore. Right? The doodles my grandchild makes are way better. Uh, exactly. You know I haven't seen my grandkid for a while now. They say no news is good news, but this isn't important. Hmm. Um. to say Can I can talk to this guy again nope I can feel it Maybe these old guys will say something else nope oh here's somebody is the cat not here today either Maybe that one really did take him. A woman? Hey, you might be talking about the cat napping case. About the cat. Oh, uh, yes, there's someone who nabs all the cats around here and calls them Snowball. That's fucking weird. Few people I know have been victims. The same thing probably happened to this cat here. That's terrible. It sure is. She's one creepy lady. Who calls all the cats Snowball, even if they're not white? But I did get her name, Mr. Yoko. I know. I asked for it when I went to the police, so there's no mistake. The police just treat cats like objects, so those little guys are family to me. I wish there was something I could do about this mess. You ought to be careful, too, since you're to toting a cat around. <sighs> not only are other cats suffering, but she's also hurting people, too. I know household is the one that suddenly got a lot of cats, right? That'll be our target. What's 
do it. Alright, let's see what I have to do really quickly. If I need to go in here and talk about this. I think I do. It appears everyone is here. this and get the next rank of death. <sighs> okay, that's all for today. Hey, if you're feeling okay, you can go home now. Hello? <sighs> what, again? That's, well, that ship's already sailed, so... <sighs> what a pain. Remember that girl from the other day, the chief staff at uh, the chief of staff Odiyama's patient? Her dad's been bringing her here to be treated, even though I referred them to another hospital. I haven't told him about the medical error I made. They must trust you. I'm just a quack, though. Hmm. The medical error was well documented. Everyone in my field knows about it. I led the development of a new drug for an incurable disease called Crawford Eanes disease. Although I wasn't the one who administered the medicine, it was I it was the cause of the error. Certain cells indiscriminately attack the other cells throughout the body. When it reaches the muscle, the patient the pa muscles the patient slowly begins to die. There hasn't been much progress pro 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 There hasn't been much progress made on it, partly because there haven't been many cases of it. I work with a pharmaceutical company that I had reached that had reached the final stage of the production, but one day I was suddenly removed from my position. The chief of staff, my superior at the time, took over the entire operation. <laughs> I don't know if he wanted the glory of developing a new drug or to become rich and famous, but... He made careless mistakes and rushed completion so he could use it on a patient named Miwa. Miwa Chan had a reaction and lapsed in a critical condition. The chief panicked and laid the blame on me. Wow. Chen and the family resented me. No matter what I said, I couldn't change how they felt about me. Wow, that's rough. It's not too late. That's fine, I guess. Well, it doesn't matter. The development of the medicine was suspended, so I had no reason to stay at that hospital. At least now I can keep working as a general practitioner on my own terms. That's the new medicine I've been trying out on you. The version is in the final stage of testing. It searches for those cells that make the offensive and destroys them upon detection. That's why it's harmless for people who don't have the disease. Probably. That's good. <laughs> you have a lot of faith in me. Thank you. Hey. You would better not flake on me this late in the game. I'm inching closer to the finish line, but I need your help to reach it. In exchange, I can offer you medicine at a special price. Hell yeah. I'm gonna buy so many drugs. Now, what should I do about that girl and her dad? Being mean and scaring them hasn't worked. Yeah, it's been a while since I've had to deal with this kind of nuisance. It's stressing me out. Oh, sorry. That's all I want to talk about. You can go home now. Whack. All right, gut stat. Bye. You doing okay? I just want to check up on you. Also, sorry for the long talk today. I wasn't planning on telling you all that. About Miwa-chan. 
Yeah, if you're the first person I've really shared all that with. But it was also a good reminder that this is something I have to do as, as the plague. Jesus Christ. Thanks to you, the drug's development is progressing very smoothly. If there are no issues with this latest sample, I think we are right on the edge of finally finishing it. Oh, sorry, it looks like I've got a patient. Maybe that girl or their dad came back. I've got to go. See you later. Oh, we're about to do some ah, stuff. Hey, Sru. So are we boned if this legal action thing goes through? Madarame is well known in is a well-known individual. The police will surely move fast on his request. We'll be arrested, and worst comes to worst, we'll be sent to some sort of juvenile hall. I'm gonna go to jail! But I thought you said it didn't seem like you'd actually go through with it. This is true. He's been bedridden since we went through with it, after all. Honestly, though, it's difficult to even tell if he's actually undergone a change of heart. I guess we'll have to wait until he recovers. Yeah, I don't feel good about that. I'll contact you all once. All at once, if anything happens, would that work for you? That'd be great. Uh, very well, I will try to keep as close an eye on Matarame's state as possible. Well, then, see ya. We have things... Things to do. Let's see. We're gonna go here. Oh, we have to sell shit. I should write something. Let's pop a save. Really need to sell stuff. Oh, we're not missing anything. Hmm? It's time for the Big Bang a Burger Challenge. All right. The challenge is conquered if you can eat the entire Big Bang Bur Big Bang Burger. To succeed, you will need knowledge, proficiency, and guts. Prevail and you'll receive a prize and an increase in a stat other than guts. Oh, win or lose, your guts will always increase. Oh, you want to do it? Take the challenge! Yeah! Thank you very much! Third mate, thus your aim will be the com will be the comet burger. For real? This burger is as vo voluminous as a soaring comet burning in the sky. It will not be overcome easily. But should you conquer this challenge, you will be rewarded with an extravagant prize. Ooh, a prize would be great. Good luck. Now then. Well, then it's time to get the 30-minute Big Bang challenge started. Ready? Go. 30 minutes to eat that big burger is like plenty of time. That thing's not that big. I mean, it's ridiculous, but you could definitely eat it. You'd hate yourself afterwards, though. It looks like there's a whole head of lettuce in here. The burger's already cold. Mm. It looks good, but it's so big. Oh, it's already cold? That'd be so fucking gr I would not eat that fucking sandwich if it was cold. Oh. Who would That's like... A pizza size, like a medium pizza size McDonald's hamburger, but it's cold. What do we get for this? Get a second mate badge. Some items. Please come again. 
knew you could do it. Well, you took that comet burger down. You're so admirable taking on such a daunting task with that intense level of courage. Nice. Two to guts. Two to knowledge. What else? Was? Hey! All right. Want to head back? So you get two charm, two proficiency, two guts, and two knowledge. That's nuts. It's fucking nutty. Yeah. In the end. Five twenty-six, huh? Morning time. Jeez. Sometimes I see people writing exactly the same things on their essays. I don't think you can get away with copying stuff from some website. I don't know, got it? Stealing someone's ideas is plagiarism. It's as much of a crime as stealing anything else. It's so annoying dealing with copyright crap these days. Oh yeah, did you know this? You know, the Arson Lupin series by Maurice LeBlanc. LeBlanc once had a famous detective character from another s series appear in one of the Lupin stories. Now then. Do you know the answer? Do you know which Arthur LeBlanc borrowed from? Um, yeah, I do. This, this is it. Doyle. Well done. No, oh, do you like mystery novels? Yes, the answer is the, uh, the author of Sherlock Holmes, Arthur Conan Doyle. It was the ultimate showdown between the definitive gentleman thief and the famous detective. Apparently, LeBlanc changed the name of his version of Sherlock Holmes when Doyle complained. Changed it to Herlock Sholmes. He just moved the S to the start of his last name. Points, 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 points. Both Lupin and Holmes would go on to appear in a number of other works, but those were homages and not plagiarism. Now our son Lupin is synonymous with the idea of a fa phantom thief. He's recognized all over the world. Yep. Well, it looks like some phantom thieves never got a style. Hey, there you are. I need your help with something. I, uh, found this flyer stuffed in my mailbox. Housekeeping service. It says that a cute maid will do anything for you. It's fucking happening. A maid, dude. A maid who will do anything for us. Right? Right? What are you saying? You're a guy, right? You know what I mean. Ryuji, Let's give it a try. Do you yeah. even know what you mean, bro? Yeah? Luckily, some guy on my floor just moved out, so there's a vacant apartment in my complex. The key is behind the mailbox, so we can get in any time. The landlord seriously doesn't care. Hmm. The place is all set, so... Hey, I heard that. Hey, I heard that, Mishima. What the hell? Um, can I, uh, get in on this? <laughs> oh, you mean you're into this kind of stuff? Wow, okay. I'm not into it. It's just for research. What does research. it mean that they'll do anything? And do the maids look exactly as they're advertised? We need to determine whether or not this company just pretends to offer housekeeping services. That's a bit much. It'll be too late once people get victimized by it. Right? So, we should do a thorough investigation. Yeah, we, we gotta see it with our own eyes. Oh my fucking god. Every little, little detail. detail. 
We'll have to do this at night, so let us know when you're ready. So what's the code name for this operation? Oh, hmm. Jesus Christ. Since we'll be watching them, it should be something like... Operation Maid Watch! Nice! I like that. Operation Horny. I'm not even gonna try to find where she's at. Oh, of course she's in the underground mall. Come in. Not that. Two more of these. Gotta have them. Don't want to forget about them. Mm. We'll just have to wait for now. Um. Yes. Oh, they're like a new place. Oh, the park. Nice. All right. Wow, is this a long one? <laughs> Man, big open places like this are great. I think my train is going to go super good today. So I remember how I said before that I wanted to strengthen my heart? Well, I came up with a way to do it. How's that? Um. I think having a strong heart means you don't let anything get under your skin. So basically, I want you to say stuff to me and I'm trying to get phased by it. Uh, what kind of stuff? You've already started. I won't let that hesitation shake me. <sighs> I guess I should say something. Come on, hit me with your best shot. Ooh! Ooh! You're an airhead, yo! Uh, can we stop yet? Uh, can we stop yet? You're giving up, that means I win. Wait, is this how the game is supposed to go? Oh well, on to round two. Yes! Bring it on. Uh, wow, you're a genius. You know, I kind of feel like this won't make our persona stronger. Ah, uh, you finally get it. Hmm. Something's not right. Oh, sorry, I just got an email from my agency. Next shoot is really far. Wait, what's this at the end? It's a notice to say, it's a notice saying to pay extra attention to the time and place they tell you? Apparently some models haven't been showing up at all lately. Hmm. Then when I asked why they didn't come, the models all say they heard there was a change in schedule. Sounds like shoots have been real hectic with all the scrambling they've had to do to get, to get substitutes. Hmm. Happened to you? Hmm? No, I haven't missed a single shoot so far. It probably really confuses the staff to see a sub showing up too. I don't think it doesn't happen to me. No, oh, actually, my first modeling gig was as a sub. That was back when I was still in Finland. My parents didn't have enough models for their event. Oh, I haven't told you? My parents are both fashion designers who put on some serious extravagant shows. They jump from country to country, so I only really see them, like, for half of the year. Maybe less these days. Oh, freedom sounds nice. Yeah, I guess I can afford to be pretty relaxed these days. Plus, it would probably be tough being a fan thief with my parents around, don't you think? It was rough when I was little, though. It was just me and our living caretaker. I don't really have any friends. Wow, that got dark fast. Yeah. Honestly, when I'm modeling... It almost feels like I'm connecting with my parents somehow. It's a nice hobby to have, but I don't think I'd want to make a living out of it. After all, that's where Kamashi the first spotted me, and that's how our class started those those rumors. Besides, the fan thieves are more important to me right now. Nobody can be my substitute there. Yes! That's why I need to get stronger. All right, we got follow up. All right. On. That's great. Oh yeah. 
Man, when I was little, I used to watch this anime where the main villain was a female thief. She'd lose to the hero every time, but I always thought she was cool. She wasn't really a good person, per se. She was beautiful, strong, sincere, and even sexy. She always said whatever she wanted, did whatever she wanted, she knew what, she, what justice was for her. I wanted to grow up to be just like her someday. <laughs> I hope I'm getting closer now. If only just a little bit. phone call time. Hey, it's me. Thanks for coming with me today. So after we met up, I tried doing some runway walks on the way home. Like, how cool. <laughs> then some girl who was watching me nearby started copying me and the run runway walked with me. <sighs> she had to have seen me, right? Do you think she thought I was cool? Hmm, could be. It's almost enough to make me blush, kinda. To be honest, I feel kinda bad for her. She had no idea the real me is a human disaster. Oof. Hmm. I guess I still have a long way to go, but I'm not giving up. I made a decision that I'm not gonna that I'm gonna get stronger, so I need to overcome any obstacles. All I care about are these free points I'm getting. Right. Ah, you're back. Buzz buzz. Hey, you didn't forget, did you? You know about that flyer. We need to go look into the truth behind that housekeeping service. I'm over at Central Street right now, so come talk to me if you're interested. Looks like Mishima's waiting for us in Shibuya. Do you think we should go see him? Um, decide later. We need to do this hey. crossword puzzle first. Um... reaction that triggers when pollen makes contact with the membranes in the nose or the eyes. Prim it primarily causes sneezing, running nose, and itchiness. I have this. These symptoms came to rise whenever English farmers harvested their pastures, leading to the nickname pollen pollenosis. Hay fever to become commonplace. Alright. I see. All it does is make me really sneezy. Nice. But god damn, does it make me feel terrible. Knowledge. Confessions of crime, like the one we saw that Letcher, Mr. Kamashita give, have the soda appellation. Confessions of crime are. Queen of evidence. Which one is right? You be the judge. The correct answer is A. Queen, yes, this is a very famous expression in the field of law. Confessions are very powerful evidence people use to even resort to torture to get them. That's a high school prodigy for you today. Forcing a confession is forbidden under law. And nice going. Damn, three points. All right, let's go see Mishima. There he is. Mm -hmm. mm. Hey, the pollen is really bad this year. Are you okay? You'd seriously look like a criminal if you had one of these out one of these allergy masks to go along with your cool glasses. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. Hell yeah. Alright. <sighs> so we're really gonna do this? You think it'll be okay? <laughs> Operation Maid Watch, bro. <laughs> uh, so yeah, Operation Maid Watch. Well. If it turns out to be sketchy, we can just bail. The apartment's vacant, so it's not like we'll be messing with anyone's home. <sighs> That's smart for you, Ryuji. Right? Oh, wait. 
I made a mistake. I made a fucking mistake. No, I have to reload! Fuck! I was supposed to tell him he's a genius. Because he gives more points. I'm a fucking idiot. No! No! Oh, I'm so fucking stupid! Me being the absolute big dumb that I am. Forgot that I'm supposed to use this as a chance to get free points with Ryuji. How many days do we lose? Just one. Uh, so back at, right before we did the Big Bang Challenge, probably. Whatever, I can fast forward through everything. Yup. Hmm? Let's do this challenge again. Oh, you want to do it? Thank you very much. Alright, fuck me. I don't need to make that mistake again. Because there's a lot of stuff to redo today. This is it. Three again. <coughs> oh shit. Fuck. All right. All right. We done this.
All right, that fixes that. Back to reverse. Uh, like, uh, you're back. So we missed like ad. We actually missed like lost like no time. Why did I say I'd go right away? Why am I like this? Mishima is just like, why are you here? Why are you leaving? I have other things to do. Like, after we do this, fuck. Hey, hey! Fixes that. All right. Knowledge. This thing is next. Queen of evidence. Nice going. Let's do it. Let's not fuck this up again. Like a big old idiot. Fortunately, we can burn through all the text. Mm -hmm. Till then. <laughs> all right. Ah, you're a genius, Ryuji. Do, do, do. Yeah, yeah, I know. To think. Kamado has a brain. If that's the case, then. And. Yep. Yeah. Okay, give him a call. Why the fuck should I do it? Go ahead, Mishima. Well, I guess he could do it too. Okay, go for it, Mishima. <gasps> Me? I'm no good at that kind of stuff. Seriously, please. But please. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you for calling. This is Victoria's housekeeping. They answered. Hey. Shh. Yeah, I take it you're interested in our services then. Services? Is there anyone in particular you'd like to request? Huh? Anyone? We want. Anyone? We want a request. What should we do? No preference. Very well. Let's see here. We haven't made available in 20 minutes. May I ask for your address? Whoa! Oh, shit, this is really happening. A maid services. Hey, what should we have her do? I was thinking we could start with some cooking. Of course, I wouldn't mind some of the other services. Should we hold a strategy meeting to discuss? Hey, you said 20 minutes, right? I gotta use the bathroom. Oh! It's almost time. You were in there for a while. Are you okay? Hey, just wash your hands. Huh? What? Who, me? You're really nervous. Huh. Are high school students even allowed to use this type of service? Huh? What? What do you mean, huh? You should have researched it. What if they find out who we are? Wait. H how should I know? Why would, s why would how old you are matter when it comes to housekeeping? been screwed if the number had shown up on their caller ID. Good evening, I'm from the housekeeping service. Huh? Oh, it's just five minutes early. What do we do? I'm not mentally prepared. Oh, the door's unlocked. Uh, may I come in? I can't do this. My stomach's acting up and my hands are all sweaty. Oh, my bad, man. I mean, you handle the rest and don't let her find out you're a high school student. I've got your back just, uh, from way back, like, from the balcony. What? What? Oh my fucking god. Guys, you're pussies. There, uh, Yuji and Mishima fled to the balcony. Oh, ex excuse me. Oh, there you are. Welcome home, master. Oh my fuck. <laughs> I forgot this was a scene. I'm going to fill your tired heart full of loving energy. And then she meows. Oh yeah, her maid name is Becky. I fucking love that so much. I, nice to be out, you. Oh my fucking god. <sighs> Thoughtless of me. I should explain our services to you. What would you like me to do today? The basics include cooking, cleaning, laundry, but there are other services we can provide if you desire. 
Hmm, you look young. Are you perhaps in high school? I'm a d <laughs> I'm in college. That's easier. Oh, your skin's so healthy. You're not lying to me, are you? Hmm. I like to I like to provide those other services, so you've matured a bit, Master. So I'll be going now. Huh? What? No. Quiet. Is someone there? Ah, oh, no. Shit, run, Mishima! Mishima, Sakamoto, and you. Hmm. Did you request me specifically? Wait, are you? Oh no, it's alright. How would you know me? This is our first meeting, yes, the first time ever. God, this is unbelievable. Yes, it's me, your homeroom teacher. Oh, I'm so done. I can't believe I got caught by some of my own students. I should have taken a job outside the city. But I needed it to be close to school so I could get there after I finished work. Hey! Who did you hear about this from? <sighs> it was Miss Chuno, wasn't it? At Harpy. Miss Chuno, the English teacher. She's been snooping on all of the teachers ever since the incident with Kamoshida. Are you going to tell Miss Chuno about this? What do you mean? Hmm. Doesn't seem like you're playing dumb. In any case, I'll get into big trouble if you tell on me. Hey, if you're gonna if you're going to side with the teacher, side with me. I'm in charge of your class after all. And if you promise not to tell Miss Chuno about this, I'll do anything for you. Hmm, what to do? Hey. It won't be any better for you if people find out that you called a maid service. This isn't even your home address to begin with, is it? I guess you at least thought about that. Well, I'll promise to keep this secret too, so why don't we both forget this ever happened? I'll treat this as if you had cancelled so you won't even have to pay for anything, okay? On that note, I'll be leaving. Don't say anything about this at school, okay? Just act as if nothing ever happened. I suddenly <sighs> feel exhausted. I want to go home. Becky, let me smash. Hello. Ah, uh, it's you. Madarame is ill, but the exhibit is still going strong. I can't respect him as my sensei anymore. But it's sad to think I don't have a mentor anymore. Uh, why not take a break? Hmm. A break, huh? I can't think of anything to do. I'm not the type to go outdoors as much. I suppose painting is what I do to relax. Well, perhaps I may need a sounding board sometimes. I hope you'll humor me then. Oh, yeah. Hey, there was something going on with Kawakami, wasn't there? Something involving Chuno. I'm not sure what's going on, but maybe you should ask her about it. She's probably still at school, right? Let's go look for her. Where do I have to go? Um, oh, there she is. Look at that fucking power stance! Holy shit! Jesus Christ. As I've been saying, get home safely. Well, then I have another matter to attend to, so I have to excuse myself. Oh, we're not finished talking yet. But I... There's been a series of scandals on this campus, and we're all being called into question. And yet, you leave work earlier than anyone, and you barely make it to the faculty meetings. Explain yourself. Don't tell me you're out running around all night. Just be like, I have two jobs, bro. Fuck off. Kawakami's being grilled. She said she'd do anything if we helped her out, so let's clear up Shuna's suspicions. The school's closing now. Head on home before it gets late. Or did you need something from Miss Kawakami? I actually have a question for her. What? What? Oh, you have another question? Another question? Ah, yes. Just phase right through the three of us. 
That's right. His questions are complicated, so I take time at night to help him. You're giving... So you're giving individual lessons outside of school hours? What passion! You are the ideal teacher. Passionate teacher is exactly what we need at this school. I'm sorry for suspecting you. This bitch is dumb! Well then, keep up the hard work, you two. Hmm. She just kind of convinced herself. But they did clear up her suspicion, so thanks. <sighs> Come with me for a, for a bit. I can't talk about this at school. This is the address and phone number of my night job. Call it night and request me. Just be careful it doesn't show up in your call history, though, okay? Hey! Hey, you did it. No call history means a public telephone. Hell yeah. Let's call Cal Kami when you're free and invite her to meet you at your room. Well. Gotta get these, uh. Massages, they're important. Okay, I have to go. What is this camera angle? Oh, okay, I see. Visit the giant the diner. diner, diner. I should write something. Please save first before I fuck up again. Yeah, that's the diner, I guess. That's the deep bowl shop. Oh, the diner's right here. I'm fucking blind. Christ. Oh. Studying will cost time to pass, will improve your knowledge. In addition, if you eat, you'll be able to improve your guts as well. Items will be added to the menu depending on the season. During bad weather, you'll be able to increase your knowledge more than usual. Hmm. Yep. <sighs> it's good that we managed to find seats, even if it's a bit overcrowded. Let's see, we're gonna get this. It sure does look good, but yeah, probably actually tastes good too. For real? You scarf that down without any hesitation. I'm overwhelmed by your guts. Why are those kids just staring at All right. somebody's moped or something? Mm. Alright, so we got that upgrade. I think we can eventually actually I think we need four to talk to one head back um oh, i already forgot what his name is here's soft store guy about the bag ah you're back hey hmm Ooh, the thieves then updated neat we're gonna do th this i'm oh. full of guts do I have the right persona to do this? Yeah, I do. Perfect. Oh! Hi! God, this is Becky. Oh, wait, it's you. 5,000 yen with the request fee included, you know? Yeah, we got that kind of money. I see. Very well. I'll head over right away then. So, this is your room, huh? Hmm. How do I put this? Uh, never mind. So, what kind of kid are you? So, is Sojiro just gonna let some random woman walk in here? The way you opposed Mr. Kamoshida, I'd say that you're earnest and have a strong sense of justice. That being said, you called a maid service and requested me? I don't have any friends. I see. Oh, that's right. You have a criminal record. Okay, then how about this? I'll let you skip class a few times. 
It's tough not having any place where you belong, isn't it? However, I reserve the right to change my mind if your grades drop. And in exchange, you won't tell anyone that I'm moonlighting as a maid. Sound good? That's definitely a fair deal. Then it's a deal. Considering. I've made a deal with Kawakami. Haven't been here in a while. To think you pulled off so many crimes while attending school. I can't believe you managed that by yourself. There had to be someone at the school helping you. What do you have to say to that? I am thou. Thou art I. Thou hast acquired a new vow. It shall become the wings of rebellion that breaketh thy chains of captivity. With the birth of the temperance persona, I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. Alright, allows you to perform various activities so we All can right. read and make stuff now. Ugh, what am I doing here with one of my students? Well, I guess I should get going. Oh, please request me if you need any help with your housework, okay? Uh, I live in a fucking attic. Well, I mean, we know each other's secret, and it would really put my mind at ease. Besides, I'm, uh... I'm considered over the hill for this type of job, so I don't get requested that often. I'll show my appreciation by making it easy for you to ditch class. Just think about it, okay? Master! Alright, that'll be it for today. Ugh. God, you have no idea how exhausting this job is. Listen, promise me you won't tell the school about this, okay? For both our sakes. Absolutely no talking about maid stuff to anyone. Ah, uh, it'll be our whittle secret. Just Becky and Master, Jesus Christ. Oh my god, that fucking face! <laughs> what the fuck is up with that face? God, yeah, please stop talking like that. You're not even gonna play along? You're killing me here. Well, I'm gonna head home. Oh, and don't forget to study for your exams, okay? If you waste all your time playing around, your grades will Bye. suffer. Oh yeah, the cleanup event is the day after tomorrow. Oh yeah, they said we were gonna go clean up trash at the park on the 30th. I'm kind of looking forward to it. That honor student is actually in my group. What honor student? Huh, what is she like? Your type or something? Either way, too bad I hear honor students are exempt from the cleaning. Totally unfair, am I right? What? So, am I alone on a team of upperclassmen then? This sucks. I want to just ditch now. I'm gonna save again. Oh, hey. never mind. Oh, look at those ducks over there. They must be a family. This place seriously feels amazing. Um, it's not even that far from Sh Shibuya, but it feels so different here. Hey. 
You know, Tokyo is so strange. There are tons of people and tons of stores, yet there are still duck-filled parks here too. It is everything, but it feels like I can't understand any of it. It's honestly kind of scary. I know what you mean. Alright, you've only just moved here. Hey. When I first got here, I had a super tough time adjusting. It's so crowded and everybody walks really fast. Almost like they're angry or something. They do say that people who walk faster are sad. Even though at school I was only ever the foreigner, nobody really knew me, they just spread rumors. I thought maybe my looks were the problem. I even considered dyeing my hair black to match everyone else. But that was when Shiho talked to me. The first thing she said was, Takamaki-san, your paintings suck. Your paintings? What? That's hilarious. I thought she was just making fun of me like everybody else. Uh, that wasn't her intention. <laughs> According to her, they were so bad that she just had to tell me. Pretty mean, huh? Still, that was the first time someone here talked to me without mentioning my looks. <laughs> we sort of just grew closer after that, and she has been my best friend ever since. That's not why we're here, though. There's something else I need to talk to you about. Hey! Do you remember when I told you what I told you the last time we come here? About that female thief in the anime I used to watch. Well, I thought of something. Sure, tell me. It's gonna knock your so- Um... You know how the villains in those shows are always going on about world domination? Well, even though they get beaten up by heroes every time, they never give up. That means they must have really solid hearts. That's why I'm going to try and learn from them. A uh, good idea. So I've decided. Yes! I'm gonna start in action movies. That's not gonna work. Yeah, good luck with that. Thanks, your support really helps. That was sarcasm. Alright, I'm huh, making this my ultimate goal for the future. You know, I've never really thought much about what I wanted to do in life, but now I have an objective. Thanks! And that only happened because of talking to you. Heightened motivation. I don't think I get anything for this rank up. Oh no, I do. Sexy technique. Ooh, chance to grab the enemy's attention and cancel their actions. All right. Hey, that's pretty good. Hmm. Well, if I wanted to be in action movies, I'll I'll need to work on my actions. I wonder how many sit-ups I'll have to do. Wait, Ryuji said he knows a good gym. I should ask him for advice. Oh yeah. Protein lovers. Jesus fuck. Oh, and I need to tell Shiho that I have a new goal. Oh yeah, I forgot she didn't die. She'll definitely be happy to hear that. Come on, let's head home. Hi, it's me. You good to talk right now? So I'd like to think I'm pretty athletic. Like I don't hate exercise or anything, but I'm exhausted just from running to the station earlier. Maybe I've got I gotta train my body along with my heart. Do you know, do you do anything to train your body? I train every day. So that's pretty much your lifestyle. You don't, like, do squats in class or anything, right? I fucking sit right behind you. Oh, my thighs are hurting just thinking about it. Okay, first I need to do research. What kind of training's best for me? For now, I'll just do some curls with a water bottle. I already drank it halfway, but that's better than nothing, right? I'll see you later. Alright, I'll be right back. I just back. Uh, you're back. i 
Let's see. Oh yeah, eight days to legal action. Completely forgot about that. All right, so we're gonna do this again. Oh! Thank you to call Cal Kami. Let's call the service. Hi. Have you been studying? Don't slack off just because you're done with exams, okay? Five hundred yen. Hey. We need to get this done as fast as possible, anyway. Cleaning shabby, I mean sophisticated rooms like this. It gives me a sense of accomplishment. If it's for you, Master, I'll happily be covered in dust. But then, doesn't it pain your heart to see such a cute maid all dirty? It does. <laughs> oh, even though your room is messy, your heart is so clean. I'll go ahead and get this over with then. <sighs> This'll do, right? Keeping it a little messy for that shabby chic feel, you know? And now cleaning is complete. Ugh. I'm exhausted. I'm not allowed to work overtime during weekdays, so I rush to my part-time job after class ends. On my days off, I have to prepare pop quizzes and homework assignments. And today I had to clean bathtubs and walk dogs before coming here. There's no time to rest. Wait, how many jobs does she have? Well, speaking of pets, this room smells like a cat. I feel a lot of strays around my house. I was surprised that you requested me. I didn't think you actually would. You weren't expecting to do anything weird with me, were you? Absolutely not. As long as you understand. I know I'm in a maid outfit, but I'm still your teacher, so don't get any funny ideas. Besides, I tried to get to involve my students, so... I need a nap. Sorry, just give me five minutes. Maybe ten. Several hours later. <laughs> and before you know it, time's up. Thank you very much. Oh, hey. You know of any part-time jobs that pay well? I assume you make, a, you make a lot since you can afford a maid service. Well, let me know if you do. What do you need money for? Well, uh... You know... It's for my little sister. She's sick, so I need money to pay her medical expenses. Hello? Yes, I made the transfer. What? Not enough. But it was the same amount as last week. I... No. Yes, I understand. Okay, goodbye. <sighs> oh, wrong number. Hey, sorry to ask you this out of the blue, but... Do you happen to have 100,000 yen I could borrow? One hundred thousand yen she can borrow. Wait, never mind. Only one of my students' money would be the worst. Hey, you may have some money, but be mindful how you spend it. You shouldn't be wasting it on services like this. Are you are you scolding me? I need the money, so I do appreciate you requesting me. However, you're my student, so if we were to get involved further, things could get complicated. I did warn you. The rest is your responsibility. You're a high schooler, after all. All right, rank two. All right. <sighs> Three more to go. Well, see you later. Okay. This master, thank you for using our service today. I really want to do a lot more cleaning for you. Is that okay? You had the wrong number. <laughs> uh, what the hell? Oh, what, what's wrong? Oh, Becky's just working hard, so she gets to see her master again. Uh, sorry, part of the job. Okay, this is driving me insane, so I'm just gonna drop the sales talk. 
Crap, my manager's coming. Oh, well, I hope you'll request me again sometimes. Bye-bye. Mm. Hmm, who could that be at this hour? Mishima's real hyped out about finding our next big target, but something tells me he's just gonna get himself in trouble. Maybe we should go with him. He said he was going to Harajuku. Let on know too. It couldn't hurt, right? Making plans for tomorrow. If you immediately respond to a message, your schedule for that day will be filled and you will be unable to do anything else that day. I don't think we're doing this. Maybe a good chance you to get familiar with the area or something. So are you gonna go to Harajuku with Ryuji? Uh no. Yeah, I kind of figured you might be busy. We already have plans. Muy importante. We have to go drink some nasty drinks because it's Sunday. Oh yeah, let's check that home shopping bullshit again. I'll just add right, this. Just in case we're gonna save here this time. Alright. Blah blah blah. Fan, keychain, something. Improved choker. What does the first one cost? It's got some gifts for people. Hey, hey. Well, let's just get this one because it's got the Got some stuff we can give to people. Well then. All right, let's go get that drink. Underground walkway. Let's see what stats this one gives. Yusuke over there with all his keys. What do you want? Well then. All right. Nice. Stats we get here. Knowledge. Um. <sighs> We're gonna go see On today, get rank five. We'll just have to wait for now. Get closer to on. Hang out Thanks. on. Get this one done, and we can get rank five apparently. For real? Hey, I have some big news. The double cream from that famous crepe shop, crepe shop is half off right now. Ooh. Hmm. Oh, but I probably can't take a crepe into the hospital, huh? I really want one though. Do you think maybe Shiho would want one too? Yeah, give it up. Right. Yeah, it'd be half off, but I should try to control oh. myself. She might have rehab today, too. They probably wouldn't even let her eat it. Um. Oh, yeah, I forgot to mention. She started her physical rehab. She pushed it ahead of schedule. I think it's because I told her about how I want to get stronger. She said she was going to start working hard, too. I haven't actually seen any of her rehab sessions yet, though. Oh, hold on. What? Now? Oh, it's not good. Sorry. Sorry, something just came up. Eh, it was from my agency. One of the models didn't show for a magazine shoot they're doing. They're looking for wrap-up soon, so I'm gonna go head over now to fill in. Let's go! It's pretty close, though. You wanna come with? Actually, let's just go. I'll race you there. Do, do, do. Well, we arrived at the meeting spot. It looks like they're having a pre-shoot briefing. Ah, and I'm so pumped to get to work with you today. After I saw you in last year's show, I just, oh, I think I'm gonna cry. Right. Um, it really wasn't a big deal. That flash and show is tiny. By the way, I'm Mika, and please, no honorifics. I might be older, but you have loads more experience. Alright, Mika. It seems a little weird saying it like that. Oh, and 
You don't need to use senpai with me. Anyway, uh, it's nice to meet you. Likewise, you're so nice. Hey, can you teach me how to be a better model? You know, your everyday routine, stretches. Mm -hmm. Routines, you mean like singing in the shower? Oh, is that all you do? Then what kind of stuff do you eat? I've been looking all over for a place to import some organic green almonds. Plus, I'm getting super tired of eating quinoa. Do I need to, like, boil it in hard water or something? Mm -hmm. Uh, almonds? I only ever eat those if they're covered in chocolate. And hard water? Isn't it kind of tough to boil ice? Do you weigh yourself? Yeah, of course. Once a year for the health examinations at school. Uh, so you're gonna keep it all a secret from me, huh? Well, I guess it's hard trusting someone you just met. Oh, uh... That's not it. I just really don't think about that stuff. It has nothing to do with not trusting you. It's more that modeling is like a hobby for me. What? Man, senpai, that's so horrible. What do you mean you don't care about modeling for these guys? You said that? Wait, I... I love this magazine. Everyone tries so hard to make sure their product is the best. <sighs> Just calm down. Don't worry. You all know that you're giving it your all here. But you guys work so much harder than me, and I'm still the one getting comforted. Wait! Hold on. And the truth is, we had both you and me could come down as substitutes for our missing model. We wanted both of you on the cover, but if you're not really interested... Hey, I didn't... Don't worry, I can do it alone. I read the concept, com, blah, 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 concept docs on my way here. Heh. <laughs> what a bitch. What? You fucking faker. You're so mean. Do you really hate me that much? S slap her. Slap the bitch. Come on. <sighs> Keep it civil, you two. Anyway, you ain't good to go. Sorry about all this, Anne. But we won't be needing you today. We'll reimburse your transportation expenses, though, and we'll even throw in a little extra for your trouble. Oh. But. Yep. That's rough, bud. <sighs> I really screwed that up. Uh, she's amazing, huh? Much better actor than you. Yeah. But maybe it's because deep down I'm not actually that invested in modeling. She sees straight through that. <sighs> anyway, I totally ruined the shoot. <sighs> but still, wasn't Mika's fake crying pretty incredible? Uh, yeah, it had grace. Do you think? Oh, maybe that's what I'm missing. I don't know, though. I think I'm pretty good at fake crying myself. I know the perfect technique. Ooh, tell me more. Listen carefully. The key is you don't actually cry. I mean, that's why it's fake. Yes! Either way, I think I'll be able to use that ability to our advantage in the metaverse. I'll turn my failure today into positive energy going forward. Heightened motivation. I like it. Crocodile tears. I need to ask less turn to negotiations. All right. Speaking of the metaverse, I'm gonna try super hard in my work with the fan thieves too. But for now, I should go stop by to see if she, to see she at the hospital. Thanks for today. Bye. Oh yeah, it's all it's Sunday, so I need to go talk to. Now then. Oh yeah, you're supposed to meet at the park for school tomorrow. Fuck. What did you forget? Kawakami said there was a community cleanup event. How the fuck do you remember, bro? You scare any changes in how's Matarame? Nothing at the moment, he's still bedridden. Ah, wait. You think this was too much for that old bastard's heart? There's no need to worry, his life does not appear to be in any danger. Eh, we an F up on our first official mission. Can he talk at all? So far, all he said to me is, I'm sorry. I haven't been able to speak to him since, though. He is in no state to hold a conversation. For real? If he ends up taking legal action against us, our leader will be in big trouble. You are under probation, correct? That would be problematic. Hey, are we going to be okay, aren't we? Uh, for sure. If Ren says so, it must be true. I'll contact all you if any progress is made. Let's just wait for the change of heart for now. And we'll be waiting for your updates, Yusuke. We got to go do a thing. 
here. Station Square. All right. I'm gonna write save. Something. Please consider what I have to say. Skip through this. Good it's evening. all the same. Let's say we head on over. Everyone. <sighs> That you possess free will does not mean that you can always do as you please. To make your decisions based simply on loss and gain is to act like a heartless machine. The reason so few people care about their fellow man is because so few have the energy to do so. We politicians have fallen short of our goal to change society. We need your support more than ever. That approach isn't going to work. You have to get the voters more excited. You're going to completely lose the hearts and minds of the people. Again? What I'd like to say is... What? Councilman Matsushita. It's been so long since we last spoke, I wanted to stop by to see how you were doing. Oh, you have a high score volunteering for you, huh? My times have changed. Do you know about the Kuramoto children? Yes, Mr. Yoshida told me. That was nearly 20 years ago. I'm impressed that you're so interested in politics. I was a member of the Kurimoto children as well. Yoshida and I joined the same year. I made an amazing career change, going from a pro wrestler to a diet member. I was elected easily, but I had no idea what I was doing. I realized I wasn't elected on my own merit when I failed to be re-elected on a second term. And that was true for the both of us. No. You've made a great comeback, though. You're truly an inspiration. As are you, old friend. You're working harder than anyone on the campaign trail. Oh, there's no need for false praise or to impress the boy here. Yoshida's well informed about the inner workings of politics, so I'm sure he'll be a great teacher. However, I suggest you only do as he says and not as he does if you want to become a diet member. Mm -hmm. And what might that mean? I'm guessing he doesn't know. Do you think you can win the election being completely honest and making good arguments? You gotta secure votes or else you'll be forever known as no good Torah. What? Without honesty and good arguments, there can be no justice. Man, it's been a while since I've heard one of your grandiose speeches. Tell me, what about Yoshida drew you in? His speaking skills. Ah, oh. well, that's quite impressive. You just may have the potential to become a diet member. You address matters quite directly for a young person. It seems you have been taught well. You're right. I intend to teach him everything I know. That's what we agreed upon. Get this next rank up. And we have Day B. Fundraising. Allows you to ask for a large amount of money during negotiations. Oh yeah, that's right. That's the one we need. Alright. Here comes the money. By the way, how are things between you and old man Kuramoto? Yes. Eh, we're still not on speaking terms. There's something I'd like to get your opinion on, so I'll be in touch. Very well. Oh, that reminds me. You may still distrust me because of what happened with the missing party funds, but I'm not the one who pointed the finger at you. That's all I'm going to say. Why did he have to mention that? My apologies, that's all for today. Well then, I'll see you Good again. Good job. Hello, oh, thanks again for your help today. What a mess. Past mistakes can really come back to bite you. It's hard to feel like you you've ever truly escaped them. Some people can fight their way back up like Matsushita, but many end up suffering under the weight of labels. Even after 20 years, I'm still nothing more than no good Torah. But I will not give up. It's true that I lost a lot, but I did learn a great many things along the way. Somewhere in the middle of it all, my my old stubbornness was tempered into conviction. My one redeeming quality. That is why I want to use your experiences. I want you to use your experiences to forge your own conviction. I will. 
Yes, you're still young after all. You have a great deal more learning and growing to do. I end up take, talking longer than I expected. Well, until next time. Hey, hey! We're cleaning up today? Yup. Got to. It's further away than school, right? Hurry up and get dressed so we won't be late. Sorry, but I'm in a bit of a hurry. You go to Shujin, right? I heard things have been rough there lately. What with that violent incident. You want to go talk about it somewhere? Thank you for your concern. However, I really am in a hurry, so... If you'd excuse me... Come on, there's no need to be shy. Like I said... If you're busy, I'll put my number in your phone so you can call me later. Sound like a plan? God, this guy sounds super creepy too. Stop it! I can't overlook this. What do you want? You're hurting her. Don't get worked up. I'm just being friendly here. Uh, what the? What are you getting so jumpy about? Like you're anything special. Sorry for the trouble. Are you okay? Yes, I'm fine now. It was pretty scary, though. Uh, um... May I ask you something? So, what made you step in to help me? Uh, because I wanted to. That's it? Well, I apologize for asking something so strange. You're headed to the cleanup as well, right? The cleanup? <gasps> Look at the time! I'm so sorry, I haven't even thanked you properly yet! Oh no, I forgot my gym clothes at school! I'll see you at the cleanup soon. We can talk more then if you'd like. Pardon me. Yo, what took you so long? Did you really come here from home in your gym clothes? Sure did. It must be so nice to be a guy. Huh? Ain't it normal? And, uh, are you planning on doing this cleanup in that outfit? Of course not! I brought my gym clothes with me. I was gonna change in the bathroom, but now there's a huge line. Oh, that makes sense. Sounds like it sucks to be a girl. Such a nice day out that even the weather seems to be mocking us. Dude, could you try pushing your way into our conversation a little less awkwardly next time? Jesus, Ryuji. I bet some Kichi Joji clean freak hung paper dolls all over and prayed for clear skies today. Hey. Morning, everyone. Huh? Are you here for the cleanup too, Doc? You got it. Uh, in those clothes? Oh, no. I'm in a difference. There you are, Dr. Maruki. We're going to start prepping soon. Prepping what? I'm part of the cooking crew. Hope you're looking forward to a solid meal. See you all later. I really like how they've worked him into the story. I can't remember if I've brought any like starchy tarot? vegetables. More like Dr. Popular. 
I'm sure the Phantom Thieves will be even bigger someday. Good morning, Shujin Academy students and staff. Please pick up all trash located in the areas assigned to your group. I thought honor students were exempt. Why is the... Oh, I guess she's the student class president. Once the cleanup is completed, a lunch of miso soup with pork and vegetables will be served. Well, there's Haru over there in the corner. Ooh, pork miso soup. Hmm. So that's what Dr. Maruki's fan club is making. Point out the main characters. FYI, the school already assigned the groups at random. They're four people apiece, boys and girls mixed. Oh, really? Now that those announcements have been made, please break into your groups and head to your assigned areas. What fucking group right. are we in? Let's just get this over with as fast as possible so we can chow down on that soup and get out of here. Hey, that guy? Yeah, him. Is he that transfer student? Yeah. You mean the one in all the crazy rumors? Keep it down. What if he hears us? Ugh. Anyone who just dumps a broken umbrella on the ground like this is human garbage. Oh, before you trash it, you have to make sure you separate the plastic parts from the metal frame. Separate it? How? Like this. Whoa, awesome! I had no idea you knew about that kind of stuff, Takamaki-san. I bet you'd make a wonderful wife. Oh, nah. Sweet, a wallet! Anything in it? Whoa, yeah, shit ton! We go in splitsies on this? Wait, shouldn't we take that to a police box? What? How was that weird? Man, this park is trash. No way this was all done by kids. It's gotta be the work of some no-good adults, too. If you don't mind, may I have the cap on that bottle? Huh? Sure. Oh, yes, forehead appears. Oh, are you a collector? Uh, not exactly. Recycling companies collect these and convert them into vials for vaccines. Huh, I didn't know that. Well, that sounds like an awesome way to bring more justice to the world. I'm sorry, but I'm not sure I follow Oh my you. fucking god, her forehead is still massive! Before I add taro to the pots, I have to rub them with salt to reduce the sliminess. Oh, you're an amazing chef! I do cook pretty often at home. Let me try this little technique here. Oh my fucking god, what, what was that? Me? What the fuck was that? Uh, sorry. The cleanup is officially complete. Thank you for your hard work, everyone. Would the leader of each group please come and get the soup for their teams? So. After the soup's doled out, everyone's free to do whatever they want. Huh. Including getting the hell out of here. Oh, okay. Thank you for everything. I don't know the best way to put it, but that sure was a crappy time out there. Oh! I finally found you. I was trying to find you so I could thank you properly for this morning. So, where'd the other people in your group go? I just banded. Ah, I see. I'm in pretty much the same situation. If it's all right with you, why don't we eat our soup together? <sighs> sure. Great! Thanks for the food. I want to thank you again for this morning. That man was even more frightening than he might have appeared to you. So I truly appreciate what you did for me. Thank you so much. <sighs> Don't worry about it, it was nothing. Sorry, but I'm not even finished. There's one more issue I need to address. I'm all 
so so sorry for what happened the other day. Uh, the other day? The run-in we had outside of the guidance office. That was like a month ago. What do you mean? Remember that was like 520 or something. There are a number of students in this school you shouldn't get involved with. This one's at the top of the list. Oh, 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 oh. the delinquent transfer student? Mr. Kamoshida had just told me about you a moment prior, so I sort of spoke without thinking there. I heard some of my classmates gossiping about you, too. Uh, were you disappointed? No, nothing of the sort. I don't like gossip or rumors and the like. And I know this will sound strange since I just met you, but you don't seem like the kind of person they describe. It'd be a different story if all those rumors were actually true, though. What were all the crimes I'd heard? Burglary, murder, and elephant, elephant tusk trafficking? Tusk trafficking? What the fuck? Yes, I go to Africa quite often. Uh, I drive without a license, too. <laughs> Even I can tell you're joking. Hmm? You know what? It just hit me. I haven't introduced myself yet. Oh, I'm sorry to make you go first. I apologize this was such a long time coming, but I hope we can get along well. I believe you already learned from our meeting at school that my... What the hell just happened? Huh, look. That was badass, holy shit. It seems to be a Shujin Academy pocketbook with the name Kasumi Yoshizawa written inside of it. Got it, just in time. Here you are. Don't let go of things you like, okay? Sorry, I didn't mean to run out on you like that. Uh, you dropped this. Huh? <laughs> I guess you sleuthed me out before I got to tell you. Well, you've cracked the case. I'm Kasumi Oshizawa, a first year. Uh, that was impressive. You mean that back there? Oh, it was just some basic gymnastics. It's not that difficult once you get the hang of it. Just a hop, skip, and a jump. Gymnastics, huh? Hey, don't you think some of those moves would be awfully useful? I was just thinking about how the Phantom Thieves need to get some sweeter moves, too. What's the matter, senpai? Wait, is there a cat somewhere around here? I want to learn your moves. Does that mean you're interested in gymnastics? That makes me so happy. I'd be honored if you'd allow me. The only problem is, I have a favor to ask for myself as well, if you wouldn't mind. Lately, I haven't been getting the results I want from my performances, and I'm worried that I'm overthinking things. So it would be wonderful if you could give me some advice whenever you have the time. Uh, you want my advice? Sure I do. I'd love if you were willing to lend me an ear from time to time. I see. This sounds like a pretty sweet deal to me. What do you think? Uh, we have a deal. Yes, sir! Wait, that's a little overboard. But I promise, I'll glean as much as I can. I've read in the reports that the Phantom Thieves' physical abilities are more acrobatic than the average person's. It seems you've gained an aptitude for specialty equipment as well. Wouldn't a natural conclusion to draw be that you were trained by an expert in that field? Well, tell me the truth. It shall with the birth of the Faith Persona. I have obtained the winds of blessing that shall lead to freedom and new power. 
what the hell just happened with the voice right there? I know it's a new line, but... but All that's right. fucking weird. And why is this only one- this one only to five? Oh, why don't we exchange contact information? Huh? It shut down. Sorry, my smartphone's been acting up lately. <laughs> it's back! Okay, I'll contact you when I've got free time, if that's- Attention, Shujin Academy students. The cleanup event will be ending momentarily. Please do not discard your trash in the bins here. Instead, bring your waste to the predetermined location for disposal. After that, we will be officially releasing everyone for the day. Thank you all for your hard work. Well, the cleanup seems to be finished. We're already in our gym clothes. Would you care for some basic training before heading home? Let's start with some core exercises. Those are the foundation for staying in shape. I wonder why she's only five ranks. It's kind of weird. Yo. Uh, another box came for you. Hey, hey, it's my stuff. Oh. Mm. Oh, finally home. Uh, you're all dusty. You're having it changed. We're gonna go watch a movie for stats. You can do a, five, a plus five kindness today. Wow. Mm. Well. Well then. Do you wanna know why I use pies? Cakes are too quick. You can't savor all the little. Taste sensations. You see, when forced to choose cake or pie, people show you their true taste. I am nothing like you. You're a psychopath who bakes for money. What? <laughs> Everything about this movie, it's absolutely ridiculous, but the protagonist's passion to fight for his friend, that's really touched me. I feel like I was able to learn how to be more compassionate to others. Stats. Watch the credits. Let's head back. And we're gonna go back. By the way, the exhibits till the end of this week, huh? Uh, we do what we could. Now we wait for the results. Want to head out? <laughs> True, it's important to take a breather after some hard work. Uh, I feel like my body will be weak if I play around too much. Alright. Last day of May. Oh, yes. I've actually gotten into fishing lately, although it's just bond fishing from time to time. I can't go to s go see fishing because I get seasick easily, so much for my dream of being a sailor. Alright, when people think of sailing the high seas, they tend to think of pirates. Even though they're ruffians who plunder other ships and coastal settlements through force. For some reason, they've ended up being romanticized. Now then. What is the answer? Do you know which peg-like parrot-toting historical figure's appearance becomes visual shorthand for pirates? John Silver. This is it. Very good. The answer is Long John Silver, a character from Treasure Island. The story of Long John Silver informed much of our modern view of pirates. Unfortunately, he only exists in fictions in terms of non-fictional pirates. Well... Captain William Kidd made quite a name for himself, I'd say. Maybe you're familiar with the story of his execution. How he declared that he hid all of his treasure in one place. No way. Oh, what? Nice going! Oh, research seems to indicate that he didn't really actually have much. Still, several novels were written based on his legend and people still look for his treasure today. By the way, I've heard that there's an island in Cuba. 
Kyushu, shoe where kids treasure is set to sleep. Hmm. Yep. Kids seek a treasure, huh? Regardless of its actual worth, there's still value in letting that many people dream about it. It's like five golden pennies or something. That'd be great, because it'd be impossible to fucking find. Alright, let's save. It. Time to save. I gotta pee again. Fuck. gonna do next let's see <sighs> maybe we have text oh on okay yeah we're gonna do this and it's just gonna be a regular hangout we're not gonna get a rank up we're just gonna get points it's one of those uh interim we'll just have to oh yeah We're gonna go back to the park. Okay, let's get going. Oh yeah, that costs money. Mm -hmm. This place really is an oasis right in the middle of the city. I can feel the trees' energy. I honestly enjoy just relaxing like this. It makes me think of a picnic, and now I'm craving sandwiches. Let's just enjoy the air. Uh huh. It's both clean and refreshing, after all. Fucking fool pollen, clean my ass! I wonder if I could get full just from taking deep breaths of it. You definitely will uh, get a runny nose. Anyway, it really is quiet here. I know, let's take a walk. I want to go see what uh, what else is around. You want to come with? Thanks. Ah. Uh. Back. Oh, there's a crossword. Hey, hey. Let's see. Oh. In contrast to imported Western art styles, paintings produced post-1900 use techniques developed within Japan are referred to Nihonga. Foreigners visiting Japan during the Meiji period called this Japanese painting, which uh, the literal Japanese translation is Nihon or Japan and Ga artwork. All right. I All right. See. Oh wow! Even I couldn't figure that one out. Nice. Free knowledge. Gonna get some more free stats. Hmm. We're gonna study here for a bit and order some food, get some stats from it, free guts. We're gonna order yep. the same thing we did last time. Actually, I wanna check something.
I wonder if the other orders give you something different. I want to check, but I don't know. <sighs> Can I not check what stats they give? Just do the same thing then. Fast forward through this because it doesn't really do anything for us because the stats, we've done it before. <laughs> Rank up got knowledge and guts, and we're in June. 6 1. Alright. I'm excited. That's Sorry. You. Sorry, I couldn't hold it in. You'll have to make some kind of excuse for me. Now for today's train news, today's headlines are employees post employees post nude chef selfie. Wild duck bird claims to have fired the employee in question. Those close to the man voiced their surprise, vouching for his seriousness at work. It should be unsafe. Crime rising. The police are issuing warnings for people to be wary of scams. Hot spots in Tokyo. Tickets for the Matarama exhibit are available until June the 5th. <sighs> the Matarama exhibit goes on until June the 5th. That's the end of this week. We'll show him what a change of heart means. Morgana, we already did it. What the fuck are you talking about? Well then. We're gonna go hang out with Ryuji. I don't give a shit on, you're not important today. It's my boy's time to shine. Up. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. So I called Nakoka and Takeshi over here. I'm gonna tell them what that Bass Yamauchi is up to. <sighs> what if they start fighting? <laughs> <laughs> you probably didn't realize it, but I recorded Yamauchi's whole combo back at the Manja shop. I'm a genius, you know. I know. Anyways, uh, I might need some backup here. Can you stick around? What do you want, Sakamoto? Takeshi. Nakoka, what the hell are you guys gonna gang up on me? Nah. Nah, dude, chill. I wanna I just wanna talk. Listen, this here's what's really going on with the track team. It'll be the rebirth of a team that found themselves in the depths of despair. The public will love it. And the best part is, not only are Takeshi's parents loaded, but his mother's the president of the PTA. And until then, he can show the others the value of obedience. It has to be a joke. Yamuchi said he'd make me the captain. Is this real? <laughs> it's Yamuchi's voice, ain't it? And on top of that, shit's gone down just like he said. Yamuchi's right, I don't have talent. I'm not like you guys. I ran so damn hard, but you two were always so far ahead. How's it like me supposed to succeed? How am I supposed to be proud of myself? Proud? My dad always talks about how proud he is of his sons. He told everyone I'd get a track scholarship like he did. And I'd follow in his footsteps as a second generation Taisei grad. That's why I listened to Yamauchi. He said if I was the captain, he'd, make, he'd write me a great letter of recommendation. Come on, man. Uh, so you trust what he was saying about Nakoka because of that stupid crap? Shut up, what does a thug like you know? You couldn't know how I feel. Nobody does. <laughs> like hell I wouldn't. How long were we running together, huh? I went through all sorts of shit with you. Who are you living your life for? Your parents? Teachers? Society? Maybe you should stop trying to live for them and just try living for yourself. You think you gotta betray people to be proud? Well, I... If that's seriously what you think, you're wrong. Hey. That Koka, you knew something was up with Yamuchi too, didn't you? I mean, that bastard's never been interested in track before. But you kept quiet. You know he was walking all over you, just let him do it. Yeah. I was afraid. Without Yamuchi, we still wouldn't have a team or a place to belong. I see. Uh, you miss running that bad? You know, it ain't so scary not having a place where you belong. You can kind of be free that way. If anything, well, I'm more scared of being a crabby person. I mean, I ain't used... I used to I used to be like you guys, afraid, lying to myself. That's before I met this dude. 
Eh, I don't want to insult you guys or nothing, but I know you're probably real pissed about all this. So if you want to hit me or something, just go ahead. I'm ready. In that case, if you insist... Ah, hey, you really doing it? Yeah, you said it's okay, all right? Wait, hold on. Uh, did you really have to keep swinging so hard? I'm actually starting to feel a little bit better already. Yeah, me too. I think I can finally put all this behind me. Uh, Coco, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm sorry too. So, you want to bring back the track team? Hell yeah. <sighs> yeah you saw that, right? That was some serious violence. Things turn out for the best. Nah, man. <sighs> I've been taking good care of this face, and look what ended up happening to it. Well... Either way, they're probably feeling way better now. I think they're gonna be f just fine together. Thanks. All I did was watch. You're telling me you just sat around while I got my ass beat? Really, you were a big help. You were pushing me to be cool that whole time. <laughs> it's kind of like I was doing a sprint and you were running next to me. You weren't cool though. Brutal, just forgot about the beat and I took? Okay. What does this give us? Chance to withstand an otherwise fatal attack with one HP. Alright. Okay. That's pretty good. Alright then. Let's go. Anyway, let's head home. See ya. Hell yeah, boy. Uh, yo, it's me. Thanks for the help today. God, my jaw's still kind of messed up. Uh, it's a good kind of pain, you know? Just like after a workout. You're gonna have to handle the rest, but I think they'll make the right call. Seeing them having a real heart-to-heart -heart talk, uh, they, they got a good team. Uh, so, case closed? I hope so. Still a long way from how things used to be, but I did all I could. Man, if those guys are really gonna go for this, I gotta step up my own gang. I'm gonna up my pace, so you better be ready for it. Respectable. Ah, you're back. I assume you're all curious, so I'm sending you an update just in case. Madarame is still bedridden, he hasn't spoke a single word. My apologies for not being able to provide anything more solid. Come on, it's not your fault, man, don't worry about it. It is June already, though. The exhibition will be ending soon. At least it doesn't seem like Madarame has had a mental shutdown. But there's no point if he don't have a change of heart and call off legal action bullshit. Well, is this how it was when you defeated Kamoshida? Eh, pretty much. Yeah, Kamoshida was out of school for a while. Either way, there has been no palpable progress. It appears only the targets the target themselves can tell whether or not their heart has changed. It's a goddamn pain in the ass, but yeah. We just gotta... Hear from Madarame himself what the deal is. Yep, there's nothing we can really do. Let's just try and wait a little longer. Hey! All that city armor I have. We're gonna go here. We're gonna go to the diner again because stats. Going in. Need all the stats we can get. You something. Oh, Makoto. Why did Mr. Kamashita change all of a sudden? I don't know. I'm not interested. You're not interested in this topic? You've dodged any immediate threats. Aren't you interested at all in what facilitated the change? Well, Hell that's no. fine. Thanks for your valuable opinion. I'll take it into account.
well then. All right, six two. I should write. Let's something. do a save. It's been a couple days. All right. Hey, Chumming, should be a blah 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 clinic. Allergies are so annoying. Hmm. Oh, thank you, dear. This is my favorite handkerchief. Uh huh. It was right in front of me, so. Oh my, you're a shy one, aren't you? Ugh. I'm not shy. My neighbor speaks highly of you. She says your medicines are better than those at the big hospitals. It's very reassuring to have such a distinguished doctor right here in town. I'll see you again soon. What the heck? Well, someone's popular. Thanks to you. <sighs> There's a lot of talk going around town about me, started by that girl and her dad. Apparently they've been telling everyone that I can make all these amazing, amazing medicines and remedies. So now the number of patients I'm seeing has increased dramatically. I don't know what some of these people are thinking though. I've had a lot of crazy requests. Like yesterday, a patient requested a sweet-smelling compress. And the other day, I had a request for a cold buster. A drug like that deserves a Nobel Prize. Other requests have included hair and skin tonics. I even had to do a consultation about a cat. <laughs> it's not like I'm some kind of genius doctor. Having fun? Stop that. No. This is all interfering with my development. I'm only interested in completing my new drug. That's my role as the plague. I'm not suited for all this other stuff. It suits you. What? Really? Well, you're entitled to your opinion. But a town doctor, huh? That sort of lifestyle profession might have been possible for me at one time, but now... Oh yeah, about those clinical trials. So many new patients, it's taking longer to analyze the data, so I'll need to catch up. This is a bit on the stronger side, but I'm sure you'll be okay. Alright, rank six. Hell right. yeah. Oh. Yeah, it looks like that girl's gonna make a full recovery. The treatment seems to be a good match for her, so at least I can breathe a little easier for now. Hopefully she'll be able to attend school soon. What? What are you so happy about? Are you excited for your next clinical trial? Well, then let's have some fun. Guts. Bye. How's my little guinea pig doing after the catch-up drug? I know it was probably a lot to handle considering I doubled the dosage and halved the activation time. God, we're so close. We're right at the end of all this. I can feel it. I'll need you to stick around just a little bit longer. I hope you can handle it. You can count on me. Well, aren't you a little go-getter? If you're that excited about it, maybe I'll just give you a dose of everything and see how you hold up. Well, I got some catching up to do. I have to process today's data as quickly as possible. Make sure to call if you ever feel sick, okay? Take care. All right. When talking about juvenile crime, you often hear about probation for reforming re repentant offenders. Oh God. Now when it comes to probation, which one of these statements is true? Probation officers are unpaid. The correct answer is B. Probation officers don't receive a salary. Probation officers are still volunteers and they are only paid the necessary amount when providing a report. Since probation is intended to encourage rehabilitation to overseas travel, it's not prohibited. Nice going! Hey, you got it right. It's pretty amazing that the chief is doing this for no pay, though. Yeah, 
Never even thought of him as my probation officer. Holy shit. I do have the big dumb. All right, we're gonna hang out with Sojiro. Okay, today we're gonna try brewing a cup of coffee from step one. You know, let's listen to what I'll tell you. These beans are Colombian, the medium fine city roast. Oh, and don't let the water boil too much. You're gonna be fine, I'll be here the whole time. Yeah. Not bad. No, well, I guess anyone can do something as simple as just brewing it. Making a blend, on the other hand, it's a different story. Mixing beans at random won't do you any good. That's because the acidity and the flavor profile all depend on the bean ratio. Pretty deep, huh? Well, tell me more, Sojiro. Oh, somebody's enthusiastic. If you're really that interested, feel free to try out whatever combinations you want to. Oh, but hands off the expensive beans, got it? Next up is the curry. There's something special about its flavor. The truth is, the scientific genius actually came up with the perfect spice combo to complement my coffee. Something about the quantification of taste. There's no formula for flavor, but it is pretty damn good. Anyhow, we don't make compromises when it compromises when it but compromises when it comes to our food service. Our stuff's gotta wow the customers. This is a tiny shop after all. Self-satisfaction is the only thing that keeps me going. Oh, it's that fucking dickhead again. You. <sighs> Haven't I already told you I don't have the money? Look at this place. Do you see any customers in here? Oh, no need to hide it, Sakura-san. You must have saved plenty from your time working in the government. Aren't you taking care of that employee right here, too? For nothing more than charity. I wish you'd show me the same kindness you show others. <sighs> You're not planning on buying anything? Can you please just leave? I'm expecting a phone call, so I don't have any time to chat with you. I don't mind if you take the call in front of me. I can talk to your little friend in the meantime. So, should we keep talking until your call comes in? Or would that be too inconvenient for you? Well... It looks like Sojiro's in trouble. What should I do? Call Sojiro's phone, obviously. Uh, it's the social services call I was waiting for. They come around pretty often to make sure this guy's not getting into any trouble. Want me to introduce you? Oh, that's right. I have some business I need to take care of myself. I'll come back later. Jeez. Uh, does he really have nothing better to do? I guess I should explain what's going on. He might try and drop by when I'm not around. That man is an old acquaintance of mine who's short on cash right now. Looks pretty friendly, yeah? Don't let him fool you. It's all an act. I have to say, though, I'm quite surprised you were quick-witted enough to pull that stuff off. Really saved me back there, thanks. Stats, 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 stats. Oh, I can make the curry. Flavor stores the SP right. of all allies. If it's 30 for everyone, that's fucking busted. Still, why do you poke around in tr other people's troubles? It's way easier to ignore them. I guess that's just the kind of person you are, though, huh? Oh, it's time already. I'd report him to the cops if he wasn't related to her. Oh, never mind that. Anyway, that's it for today. Go study or something after you close up. I can see the compassion hidden beneath Sojo's actions. I feel my kindness growing. Hey, sorry about today. Didn't mean to get you wrapped up in my problems. I probably don't have to say it, but if that guy shows up while I'm out, just try to ignore him, okay? Just let him do his thing and get on with the job, got it? Understood. Good. Whatever he says, just don't let it get to you. You're still under probation, so don't cause a scene. Alright, I'm trusting you on this. Later. Oh yeah, we need to tear this book in. I think 
think this is the one that gives kindness. Mm -hmm. Hey, hey. Well, that book's halfway done. All right, everybody, quiet down. I'm changing my lesson for today. Instead of regular class, we'll be reviewing last week's materials. I suggest you listen carefully, but don't think you can slack off, okay? I absolutely won't allow it. No slacking off. Hmm. Weird. Hmm. She's going totally against the curriculum. All the stuff about slacking off was a little odd, too. Wait a second. Is this what she meant by ditch class? I would have thought she'd let you leave the room or something, but I guess she really can't complain. What do you want to do? We're gonna read and finish that book since we just started it. That's five kindness. I th think. What are your thoughts? Chico's story. The dog who kept waiting for his master in Shibuya, huh? A noble and loyal friend to the end. I have to admit, this story moved me. Can't you feel it warm your heart, too? That was great. Oh, it's a free day. Wait, what is this? Oh, one of the jobs. Yeah, that that's a big fat fucking no bud. Something. Oh, this is not the right place. So I talked to Shio about what happened with Mika back at the photo shoot. You know what she did? She laughed. She couldn't stop talking about how tough she thought Mika sounded. Honestly, though, it was kind of refreshing. I'm not even mad anymore. I guess you really just need someone to laugh at you if you want to feel better. Seems that way. Uh -huh. I mean, they always say laughter's the best medicine, right? I've seen the truth of that saying firsthand. But anyway, even though I'm trying to strengthen my heart, Shio's the real strong one here. Hey. I went to one of her rehab sessions the other day. She said she wanted me to be there. So I agree without thinking much of it, but I ended up being pretty overwhelming. How so? It was a lot tougher than I'd ever imagined. It was horrible. She was dripping with sweat, teeth clenched. She was clearly in a lot of pain. Apparently she can't even move her feet. She said it feels like her legs are filled with sand. But she dragged them along, legs swollen with blood. I just wanted to make her to stop. Make her stop. Oof. By the time it was all over, she was in tears. It was really tough on her. She said she wanted to give up. Yeah, that's why she asked me to come to keep her motivated. The whole th the whole time she was complaining about things in ways she normally never would. But even with that, she finished her session. Uh, I don't know why I'm crying. I didn't have to go through that. Is it because I'm weak? It's because you're kind. Uh, you're wrong. You know, even through all the, that pain, I thought Shio was so cool and beautiful even. Despite all of her complaining, she still tried incredibly hard. Strength is more than just not getting phased. It's the power to fight through adversity. So I was thinking, uh, what can I do to help Shiho? Um, show her your own strength. My strength? Yeah. yeah, I'll do just that. I'm gonna give it my all. You know, being with you really helps me see things clearly. What I should do, the true meaning Thanks. of strength. Well, thank you for that. All right. 
Ah, your status ailments. It's pretty good. Ah, my nose is all runny. Ah, what are you looking at? What are you looking at me like that for? Pretty girls get runny noses too, you know. Bye. I'll see you around. No, it's me. Thanks for earlier. I feel better now that I got to talk to you about everything. I'm gonna try my best to help Shio out in my own way. Maybe our relationship won't ever be exactly the way it was before. But now that I saw her crying, I know I'll find something I can do for her. I'll cheer you on. <sighs> Thanks, I can't I can't let her leave me behind. Watch me, one day I'll be cool and strong just like Shiho. I feel great now that I got everything off my chest. Rank six on that. Ah, you're back. Hey, hey! Crossword puzzle. Label for an unparalleled. Oh. M. A. S. T. That's pretty easy. Most often used in the phrase, Master of the Arts. It's reserved for artists with incredible skill and techniques that grew to be heavily influential in their mediums. One of the most prolific masters in painting, Pablo Picasso. Also has one of the longest full names in art history, 103 letters total. All right. I see. Nice. All right. Why we need so much hey. fucking money? I completely forgot about this. What? Wow. Wait, seriously? Master. Well, did you enjoy the maids cooking and together with the maid service I provided today? The high-end cup news really do make a difference, don't they? Sure. They are pretty complicated, though. It says to drain the hot water once and leave the sauce packet on the lid so it gets warm. Don't request me if you're going to complain. Besides, I thought I warned you already. Why would you request me again? So I could slack off in class, duh! Hmm, are you sure that's really the reason? Well, I guess I'm in no position to complain since I'm making money from it. Ugh. I'm so tired. We had a faculty meeting just the other day. Why do they have to last so long? Jeez. Thanks to Phantom Thieves, the students have really been restless lately. The teachers can't agree on what to do about them or the Phantom Thieves. I wish they just talked more about bonuses instead. I heard they might even cut the teacher's salaries. I'm so sick of it. I'll request you more often. Oh, really? I'll continue to, s to serve you with all my might, Master. I'm gonna be in trouble if I don't pick up more shifts. Hello? What? How much? I can't. Yes, but that that's true. Sure. Yes, I understand. Yes, it's my responsibility after all. Oh, did you hear that? Yeah, I'm a little behind on my sister's medical bills. Are they that expensive? Apparently it's some crazy incurable disease, so there's a lot of fees and extra charges. That's why it'd really help if you requested me more. Oh, never mind. You're my student. I can't keep relying on you. Oh, what the hell am I gonna do? Anyway, it's time for me to go. Hey, feel free to call me to uh, call me to do housework. It doesn't have to be through the maid service. I live close by, so I can stop over whenever you need me. Besides, I'm worried that you can't cook or do laundry because you don't have your parents. Oh, and if your friends suddenly come over, I can always just leave out the back way. I should request Kawakami to brew coffee or do laundry for you. All right. I can have her do laundry for me. Maybe. Hire Kawakami to help you at home. 
Shall be save time. Oh. I need to get requested more. Good night. Fuck, I always forget the fucking vibrate is on. Oh, is this master? Thank you for using our service today. Wasn't my meal so delicious? Could you taste all the love I put into it? But you can't just eat cup noodles, right? You need balanced nutrition. Maybe next time you can try some of my house-made cooking instead. Seriously, though, you're still pretty young, so you really need to eat properly. Thanks. You can thank me once you start making actual improvements. Um, I know this is kind of silly, but do you really need... But you really do need to eat healthy, okay? I mean, considering how much you spend on requesting me, you can probably afford some good food. This is true. I don't have a kitchen, though, you dumb bitch. I have to eat out. That's my only option. Otherwise, I starve. We're getting started. <sighs> it's getting humid lately, huh? But it's times like these when you've just got to push through the funk. Don't let the weather get to you. Well, that was the plan anyway. Then I got police officers asking what I was up to. Do I really look that suspicious? Ah, yes. Oh, but speaking of looks, have any of you seen someone you thought was cute and immediately decided they must be nice too? That thought process is totally normal. If not always accurate, there's even a name for it. How about you? Any guesses? That's the halo effect. I think. If that's in here, that's what it's gonna answer. This is it. Right. Correct. I'm surprised you knew. You get distracted by superficial qualities and you... And your broader perception of someone can get biased. Once you get that far, it's hard to make totally obje objective judgments. Like, that person is quiet, so they must be scary. Stuff like that. Oh, he actually knew that. Maybe we should ask if I can borrow his notes. Nice going. Halo effect isn't all bad, but I recommend you give people the chance to define themselves instead of making snap judgments. After all, it'd be a shame if your biases kept you from noticing something truly wonderful about someone, right? Plenty of terrible people look perfectly decent on the outside. The Lady Elm looks perfect, and she is perfect. <sighs> oh, it's raining. Let's do it. All right. What do I need to do next? We'll just have to wait for now. Oh, yeah. Should I do a on? Okay. Uh, Shibuya, huh? Yeah. That's where the Wilson Buffet is. Wanna go? Um, that's I think that's our only option because it's raining. The buffet we went to before. I'll need to make sure I don't eat too much. Okay. Okay, let's get going. Mm -hmm. oh, this looks amazing. This place is so much on their menu, it's hard not to overeat. Oh, how about this? Operation Eat a Bit of Everything. That sounds like a good plan. Right, it's quality over quantity. Honestly, it was crazy how much my stomach expanded last time. But I've reflected on my actions and I won't make the same mistake again. But, can you keep an eye on me? I think as long as you do, my resolve won't crumble. Yes! Well, let's get eating. The order you eat things in seems important. Let's start with the stuff that digests quickly. Seriously? Hmm, they need this little present for being their millionth customer. No wonder this place is expensive. I'm amazed they give out stuff Aww. like this. I feel like I'd just eat from it non-stop if I kept it at my house. Can you take it? Chocolate fountain. Nice. Get those stats. Back. 
The exhibition ends tomorrow. Madarami must have had his change of heart by now, right? Yeah, I'm sure it'll be fine. So far, nobody's come charging us with anything, yeah? But, wouldn't he wait to press charges until after the exhibition? What should we do if someone contacts us about it tomorrow? Yeah, try asking Yusuke. He's still staying with Madarame, right? Oh, uh, that's right. Where is Yusuke? I wonder if he'll be okay with Madarame. Sorry I'm late to contact you all. It seems something will certainly be happening tomorrow. Madarame is on the phone as we speak. Uh, what do you mean, something? I believe he's preparing for a media announcement. I didn't hear anything about pressing charges. Yes, we just gotta wait then. Let us meet in Shibuya tomorrow. The exhibition is finally ending tomorrow. I'm sure things will work out fine this time too. We're gonna do this. Then I'll head over. Clean room. Three points. We're gonna need them Thank for later. Thank you for using our service. Oh, here we go. What's up with that old geezer? Oh, is he crying? I... I have committed crimes that are unbecoming of an artist. Plainly put, I... Uh, plagiarized work. I... I tainted this... This country's art world and... and even Sayori... How could I... I possibly apologize to to everyone for for what I've done. <laughs> <laughs> He's crying way too much. <laughs> and that was from the urgent apology conference by Matarame that took place just a moment ago. After reporting to the association, Matarame has agreed to the police's request to turn himself in. Wasn't he on TV the other day? On top of charges of abuse to his pupils, Matarame is under suspicion of claiming their works as his own. Some doubt the validity that his maiden work, Sayuri, was stolen, believing it was used for fraud. This large-scale criminal act has caused a great shock to the art world, and... That old man's done for. After the conference, Matarame was taken to a police hospital for interrogation due to his age. However, initial psych evaluations state that he is mentally sound and likely responsible for his actions. There's no need to be nice to an old geezer like that. Why'd he spill the beans himself? Doesn't that seem weird? Also, a group calling themselves the Phantom Thieves posted a dubious note at Matarame's exhibit. The police will investigate their relation to this case, but for now, did not identify them as suspects. Phantom thieves? Do these bandits have something to do with that old geezer's apology? Oh, I've heard of them before. They supposedly steal evil hearts. It's why the culprits apologize. Wait, what? Steal hearts? <laughs> That's impossible, though. But I feel like I saw something about that online, too. They sent out a calling card for real. Oh, so it was like, we're going to take your heart? Oh, that's impressive if someone really did that. Phantom Thieves, huh? Phantom Thieves again. You guys see the news about Madarame? It's just like what happened with Kamoshida. And they mentioned the Phantom Thieves! Man, this is starting to get interesting. If we do it right, we can change people's hearts. With this power, we might be able to do more than just getting back at society. It'll be a big deal. <sighs> I don't know. Man, you're so indifferent. Then again, doesn't that make him more trustworthy as our leader? As for me, I hope we just keep getting more and more famous. Something like this happening twice is massive, too. It's too great a coincidence to occur normally. 
If we continue doing this, we'll definitely be able to give courage to everyone who needs it. We may want to quiet down a little. Do you know them? You moron! Those are attendance officers! Hello there. May I speak with you for a moment? Ah, yes! How can we help you? That monotonous acting of hers never fails to send a chill down my spine. What are you all doing here? Are you friends? Oh, we wanted to get some tea. Hmm, is that so? And how would you do that in a place like this? We were just discussing where we should go. Well, all right. Just make sure you disperse before it gets too late, okay? There have been some odd happenings lately, and the news about that artist has caused quite the stir. We'll be careful. It's still light out. Man, those guys must have way too much time on their hands. Hey, don't go making stuff up on the spot like that, okay? I totally panicked because of you. From now on, we'll need to be even more cautious than before. Look at us. Right after the second thieves incident, both prior victims are meeting up. Wait, you mean people might be listening to us? It'll be fine. Look around, we're the only people worrying about it. I guess you're right. By the way, Yusuke, you able to get anything out of Madarame? Remember how he was talking about that suspicious person in the black mask? Well, I pressed him for answers, but he doesn't even understand what happened to him to begin with. It's not like he actually saw his desires get stolen, after all. It's rumored that he may be sent to prison. In that case, gaining information will be difficult. So, what are you gonna do now? I'll be leaving that house. I can't draw on such a place anymore. Do you have somewhere to go? The school dorms. I can stay there free of charge thanks to my fine arts scholarship. A scholarship? Wait, you're that good? Although, Takamaki-san's house would do as well. Wait, what? To you be know, fair, you could ask her to model for you whenever you she's wanted. loaded. So she has Come to have on. a big house. Then again, now that Yusuke will be living alone, it'll be easier for us to meet up whenever we want. For the time being, we should wait and see how this case plays out. Uh, and it'll probably take some time finding a target as big as Madarame. Anyway, we should just act like normal students while we look for our next target, okay? We'll be entrusting that to you again, Ryuji. Alright, guess it's just more prep till then. Yusuke Kitagawa. So after Shiho Suzui, you did it again for someone you barely knew? You were sent away twice, almost reported to the police, and yet you still wanted to save him. Moreover, you ended up in a museum instead of a castle this time. You're still going to maintain this rubbish about changing someone's heart by stealing their treasure? <sighs> Take it how you will. <clears throat> Very well. The truth behind this tale of yours will be clear once your conspirators are in custody. Now then, tell me about this new member who joined your group. There's no point in being stubborn. It will only damage your position. The identity of Madarame's pupil can be easily discovered with a little investigation. <sighs> I'm not telling. So you won't sell out your accomplice? Nope. <sighs> not today, bitch! Fine. There's still much more that I want to hear. It was around this time that the Phantom Thieves began to truly gain popularity. Lies flooded the internet. Things like the Phantom Thieves saved me too, or I got a calling card. For heaven's sake, those lies made the collection of intel take almost ten times longer. Now your next target was this man, Junya Kaneshiro. Oh yeah, this guy. 
He doesn't compare to the previous two. Even the police had been struggling to apprehend him. So, exactly how did you take down such a well-guarded criminal? Tell me. Um... I can't remember how that happens, actually. But I know your dumbass sister fucks up and... Something bad happens. The suspect happens. has repeatedly testified that he does not have any recollection of his actions. A full psychiatric evaluation will be performed to further investigate the crime's details and motives. First Kamoshida at Shujin Academy, and now Matarame. I found a number of points of commonality between the two. Both, for example, were sent a calling card before their unforeseen changes of heart. I see. But isn't tying their cases to the series of psychotic breakdowns jumping to conclusions? Furthermore, the police will frown upon you stepping into this. Now isn't the time to be worrying about things like jurisdiction and honor. We need to dig deeper and find a correlation among the incidents these past two, three years. <sighs> Very well, I leave it to you. However, you must not let this interfere with your regular duties. Thank you, sir. Hmm. That damn woman just had to stick her nose into this. And I understand that these abnormal incidents have caused some anxiety throughout our country. This situation must be approached with the utmost seriousness. I shall continue to put forth great effort so that every citizen can live with peace of mind. Not only are there these phantom thieves to worry about, but if that is exposed... <sighs> Oh. It looks like Yusuke's texting me. I think you're getting them too. I'll need this auto off. You have my gratitude. Why are you so polite for all of a sudden? I truly am thankful for you, uh, to you for making me come to my senses. <sighs> you're exaggerating. I most certainly am not. I express my gratitude earnestly. Hey, you're one of us now, man. We'd be counting on you, too. Of course. And if anything comes up, we won't hesitate to lend a hand. Thank you. Oh, neato. Well, then, see ya. go through all that trouble to thank us. He's such an honest guy. Anyway, that went well for our first job, huh? It was a huge success. So, that said, you got time after this? Um, Ryuji, I don't know if I do. Uh, for what? You know. Well, the thing is, I got some free tickets to a darts lounge from this guy I know. But I totally forgot they expired today, so you wanna go right now? <sighs> Ryuji, didn't we just finish talking about how we needed to be on guard? Come on, it's just dark. So don't you want to play two more, Ghana? I mean, if you can actually throw anything. Mm. If you're just going to play, then I guess it shouldn't be a problem. Alright, then let's head to this darts lounge or whatever it, it is. Lead the way, yeah. Ryuji. Hell yeah, I'm on it. Alright. Alright, the place is in Kichijoji. So, we gotta take the train first. I've never been there. Oh. For real? There's a bunch of different shops right outside let's the station go. there. It's just one stop away from Shibuya, so let's... Head for the Inagami line first. What the f God, I'm glad these signs are translated. I never realized that. Hey! <sighs> these stairs will take you to the Inagami line. That's this is the way to Kichi Joji. Let's go! Alright. 
The school commuter train pass allows you to travel for free on two railway lines, Young and Jai to Shibuya and Shibuya to Aoyoichi Ichome. Yeah, you'll have to pay a fare to travel outside these areas to so make your travel plans accordingly. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Those two. Makoto, you're kind of a creepy stalker right now. Oh, so this is Kichi Joji, huh? And you can tell it's nothing like Shibuya just from the atmosphere alone. Oh, yeah. It looks like there's a lot of shops here that you can't find in Shibuya. Not that I'd really know. Hmm, seems interesting. Right? Oh, it's got your attention now, huh? Oh, it's not here because she's busy, but I bet it'd be fun to come here with some more people. I think the Darts Lounge is one block up from the main right. street. Since we're here, I won't say no to checking out a bunch of their shops on the way. Yeah, same. Casual Suit Center. Apparently we shouldn't talk to the lady at the info stand. I f um. My, what a coincidence. Oh my god, she's so out of place. It's fucking adorable. Absolutely fucking adorable how fucking out of place she is. It's fucking funny. It's funny as how to look at. Stationary store. Man, I'm gonna save something. because I'm afraid I'm a dumbass. But I wanna look at all these other stores. It's a fucking new area. Hmm. Well. Take your time. Oh get I don't know what the fuck that was, but I don't care. It's 12k. <laughs> Uh, they have a closed store? Hey. Bring your sooty clothes here, sooty clothes. Hmm. Yeah, let's see what they've got. At the second hand shop, you can sell your sh the sooty armor you own, depending on what the sooty armor was originally, it may fetch de a decent price. For each clothing item you sell, you obtain shop points. Nice. Hmm. I want to see the prizes. Welcome. Yeah, I don't have any interest in selling this. Not right now. <laughs> That's neat. Person sells oh. fried food. Uh. Oh, nighttime. Whack! Wait, what's this? Oh, a shrine? That's so huh. neat. Nice. We can go to a temple. I bet having a temple in a shopping district really helps the business. Can we go in? Can we go hey. in? Oh, that's. Wait. Hey! Oh, let's come back another time. Whack. Check the vending machines. Fuck it. Oh. There's nothing good in here. Oh. Um. Ooh, what is this up here to the left? Is this like a, a music place? What is this? Oh, it's a jazz oh. club? Dude, you get jazz? That's cool. Either way, yeah, it looks like it's only open tonight. Yo, they added so much shit! Oh, this is fucking awesome! Imported goods? I see. Welcome! Holy shit! I'm buying that. I can afford it. <laughs> oh. No, oh, this is the road. Hey. The name of that shop matches what's on the free tickets. Pengu Sniper. It says Penguin Sniper, huh? Why'd you give one of the, why'd you give one of those doofy birds a gun? For real? It's not to be taken literally. 
Still, if you're coming up with a good name, well, whatever. Whatever, let's check it out. Nice. What is beside it, though? Wait, there's two stores here. Oh, an optician. I keep forgetting, but your glasses are fake, huh? Do you think I'd look smart if I had glasses on? Wait. Are my glasses fake? <gasps> what? Wait, what? Uh... Okay. Whoa! Oh, here's... here, this is the place. Oh man, I'm getting kind of nervous. Yeah, hey, you're such a child. Try not to embarrass the rest of us, would you? Hey, you don't gotta tell me that. So what's the plan? You wanna head inside? Yeah, let's go. I already seen everything I wanted to see. It's a bunch of new shit. You can now quick travel to darts and billiards and Kichi Joji. Alright, bull! That's a new high score! Hmm, you seem to know a lot. The center of the target's called the bullseye. If you land a dart there, it's called the bull. I know because I looked up the rules online last night. Anyway, this game's called Zero One. You win by getting your score all the way down to zero points before the other player. Oh, so you're not trying to get a high score, but get rid of your score? That's pretty different. We both start with the same score. Then you lose points based on the number on the board where your dart lands. Hmm. And you can only win if you get your score down to zero exactly. You can't even be off by a single point. How's that sound? Pretty sick, right? So you have to be able to calculate your score properly while making sure you hit the right numbers on the board. This game seems like it takes a lot of concentration. <laughs> One point? Come on. You have to straighten your arm out more and... Hey, Ryuji, what's up? Ah, I was just reading this flyer. It says, darts is a party when you play in pairs. You team up with someone mm. and alternate throwers when it's your turn. You still use the same rules I told you, though. Hey, what do you say we give it a try? Hmm. Yeah, sounds fun. Hell yeah! That's what I'm talking about. Let's do this. Whoa, a bull right off the bat? Man, talk about an exciting opening. Here goes. Don't underestimate an ex-athlete. Hell yeah, triple 20. Whoa, he hit such a tiny spot. Quite impressive, especially for you, Ryuji. We're almost down to zero points. Let's really focus for this last round. Woo -hoo -hoo -hoo! Zero points right on the dot. Oh, ain't we badass? That's no easy feat. You really do have something special going on. Synergy between Man, me and my boy. This is so fun. When you're on the line, the pressure's insane. But it makes you want to do your best for your partner. Oh, what is this? Baton pass rank 2, damage up HP recovery. Oh, this is neat. Hmm. Now I get one up too. Oh, shit. Rank 2, increase damage up, heal HP after baton pass. Heal even more HP, recover SP. You can verify a party's member baton pass rank on the stats screen? That's fucking nuts! <laughs> Based on the looks on your faces, I'm guessing both of you got something out of this game. Even if it is just a game, it can be some kind of training, depending on how you play. Someone's dedicated. <laughs> well, I do always have the phantom thieves on the brain. Let's keep practicing together here. Uh, oh! Let's invite everybody next time! Man, all this just from me asking you to meet me here? This is like 
Ah, uh, you know, one of those strikes of good luck. A stroke of good luck? Why would it be a strike? Who would protest having good luck? Ooh, he's a little that? confused, but he's got the right idea. Oh yeah, they have pool here too. Hmm, this game could be useful too, depending on how we look at it. Yeah, it's already pretty late though. We can come back and play it later. Hmm. Ah, and don't forget, we got a couple free tickets to play today, but next time you'll have to pay up. But it was super fun, right? Oh, I really want to play again sometime. Well, we should head home for the day. Thanks for hanging out. Oh, it's Sunday, so we have to go do a speech with the guy. Fuck. Hey. Uh, if I remember correctly, you transfer lines at Shibuya, right? I heard customers say it's gotten pretty dangerous over there. Don't let yourself be a target, got it? Mm. Hmm. That said, you still want to check out Kichi Joji at night, don't you? Don't worry. Worst comes to worst, I've got your back. You're a regular house cat. Besides, there's a certain, a certain delicious smell on that street that bears investigating. Picked up some interesting info you might want to hear. Apparently, there's this old man who's been causing problems in Kichijoji. If you make one wrong move or say the wrong thing, he flies into a rage and it turns into a fight. Even if you don't hit him, he lies and says you did, and then he sues you for damages. So he's like a con artist or conflict artist. That's fucking ridiculous. I agree, we can't let this guy go unchecked. My problem is knowing that he's an old troublemaker isn't enough to get us a name. But I did hear that he hangs out in Kichijoji's Harmony Alley a lot. Hmm. I should write something. All right, let's see what we gotta do. Young and Jaya. Fucking, I need to go to Kichi Joji to figure this out. Hey, hey! We have a target we haven't identified, right? Let's go to Harmony Alley and gather some information. Texted me. Yeah, I gotta go see him in a minute. I gotta go drink the damn drink too. Can't miss that. Everyone's talking about Matarame. No, no, no. Featherman. No. How many alleys probably right here? That make a lot of sense, but doesn't look like there's anyone I can talk to. Let's go this way. Hmm. See anybody else talking about him? Probably, yeah. Hmm? Here we go. That old man hasn't come come here yet. No wonder I'm drinking in peace. I don't like the I don't like bad mouth of my customers, but he makes so much trouble. An old man making trouble? Hey, do you think they're talking about the elderly man who is causing trouble in Kichi Joji? Hey, this isn't a place for a young and like you. You better look. F you looking for something around here? Oh, the conflict artist. Oh boy, so even kids like you know about him? That old man's out of control. He takes drinks from strangers, he starts fights. And when he gets in trouble, he causes a ruckus and tries to mooch money off people. What's creepy is the more trouble he makes, the wider his smile gets. Got a name? Oh yeah, the old man's always shouting his name over and over. Hey, Giono, right? Yep, that's the name. Well, that was easy. But you know, I can't, I can't be that hard on him. He's around my dad's age. When he complains about his joints hurting on rainy days, I can't help but feel sorry for the old man. I wish he didn't hang around here, but... stayed warm with his family instead. <sighs> you might sound awfully sympathetic, but I know you really think he's a pain in the ass. Well, yeah, I'm not denying that. Mm. 
Ash joins her on rainy days. Poor okay, guy. Let's go. I don't think we. I think we got all the info we needed. Why don't we just uh? Yeah, that's it. That's finished. Bounce out of here. Underground walkway. Uh, the five thousand dollar drink. Alright, finally made it under 200k nice. Yen, fuck me But The next time we go into the palace of Mementos We can get tons of money Alright, last thing to do For this week Let's go talk to this guy Need to talk to Yoshida because I'm going this on Sundays Everyone The conviction of government is often tested during times of turmoil. However, the current administration refuses to discuss their plans for the future. Can we really accept such an utter lack of transparency? I've been hearing this type of criticism about the government a lot lately. That's because Diet member Shido has been gaining popularity by saying the same thing. So he's just echoing another politician's criticism of the government? Apparently, tch, whatever. It's so first you stole party funds and now you're stealing ideas, no good, Torah? Stop talking all big, you ex-convict. Hmm. Uh, it seems I'm drawing the ire of the audiences once again. So he's claiming those who have made mistakes in the past should get a, shouldn't get a second chance. What can I say to that? Stop interrupting him. What was that? You got something to say to me, kid? What do you think? What's up with this kid? Let's know what he has to say. Why, you little punk. Yes, I am no good Torah, and I have made mistakes. Yes, I am unpopular and powerless. But that has nothing to do with my arguments. These are things I learned from all my hardships. Yes. You can ridicule me all you want, but I will continue to oppose what is wrong with this world. That's how you do it right there, baby. Today's speech ended up being filled with a lot of passion, quite unexpectedly, I might add. The highlight, though, is your yelling. I just spoke the truth. That's very promising. Oh, don't overdo it. You should avoid making enemies whenever possible. Okay, that's it for today. Hey, you two are amazing. I've been wrong this whole time. Even though someone has failed in the past doesn't mean that person can't try again. That's all I wanted to say. You. Please wait. Thank you. Thank you. That is all I wanted to say. You're a strange one, just like that kid. I learned something from your dauntless spirit today. I have a bad habit of getting flustered whenever someone calls me no good Torah. But you, but you see me as someone of value, so I refuse to cower to criticism in front of you. <laughs> today you taught me that I must have more confidence in my arguments. We're gonna get this rank up, and that's gonna be it for today because I am tired as fuck. All right. All right. <sighs> Charm points. Nice. I shall ask you again another time. Phone call. Thanks for all your hard work today. Thanks to you, I remember something very important. Now that I think about it, ever since the scandal, I've felt alone and helpless, like the whole world was against me. Perhaps I got too used to the constant judging and critique, but I realized I'd overlooked something crucial. I'd forgotten the people who support me and now encouraging, and how encouraging it feels to simply be in their presence. Perhaps it seems too obvious or too trite, but I hope you remember to cherish that too. I will. Good, I'm glad to hear it. I will engrave it into my heart. I can't just let myself forget it again. But I'll be counting on you for my next speech, too. Alright, oh, that's it. I'm gonna go to bed.